dude. Y'all, Jason just forgot what tater tots were no, in the pre stream. I, I, we have to discuss this now. I'm putting them on blast. I, I, I was like, I'm eating this. I just forget the fuck technical term for it. I, on, the what's the, the technical this, term. What's, it's what it's called. No. What's man. the name of this potato? There's so many potato products. I was, eating, product. I I was can't eating, keep track of all of them. Zach. I was eating. I was eating salmon and potato. I was like, wait a minute. I know the name of this. I just forget, man. Halucha. That's a great potato fucking. tier list. Yeah. I just oh. all the different forms. I mean, Hash half of them are patties, S tier, and then the rest pancake. are fine. Actually, that would be an impossible tier list, because potatoes in, like, any form are really fucking good. Like, like, fries, chips, fucking tater tots, Hash like, all patties, of them, top yeah, tier. Bro, baked potato ain't it, bro. Like, I'm sorry. It's no, baked potato hot. would be lower tier, for sure. But you put I a gun to my- I then, box boy. Like, what do you want from me? Jason, two seconds ago, you forgot what a fucking tater tot was, so I don't know. Yeah. Maybe sit down. <laughs> yeah, well, forgot the name. I woke up like two hours ago. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Ghost Trick with an actual lawyer. I'm your host, Zach, joined by Jason. Fuck, I thought you were going to do Critch first. Um, I always do you first. Uno, dos, quace, quattro. I don't fuck. Quace? Know. Quace, trace. You I know what? Just for that, I'm putting the the bit about you forgetting what tater tots is in the stream. The I idiot. didn't forget. I said I forgot the name of them. That's completely different. That I knew is... what they were. That's okay. Not the, that's sure. not the same thing. Sure. No. Jack, hey. Back me up. That is clearly not the same thing if you forget the name for like a slight year. You it's know what I dog. meant. No way, dog. Hey, and no also joining way. us is our actual lawyer, Bridge. Wait. I forgot what an introduction is. <laughs> And I forgot how to read. Uh, yeah, folks, how to read. if you like this stream, you can catch it and many more on twitch.tv slash save a team. And if you'd like to support us, head over to patreon.com slash save a team. Throw us a couple bucks, just two bucks a month. Get you access to VODs of every single stream we do. Uh, five bucks gets you uh, voting rights on which streams we do each month. And for the $10 level and above, you get your name included in the Patreon wrap. Thank them, thank them, gotta thank them all. Gotta thank them all, our Patreons! Vergabon, Les, Bandicoot Commando, Cud, Dave, Shadow, Navi, and Sofino, HSM, Urn, Sunayama, Antelester, Kevin, Asian, and Alucha! Shout out to Jaco, Bell, Taco Sensei, our key, Forensic, Beck, Nicole, and Mystic, Woody! Dessert Boy Man, Elijah Sly, Rick Rat, Katja, Traveling in a Box, and Snowcats, Naru Kuyangi, and Fulfilla, Written Word, Shade the Punisher, Sevilla! Thank him, thank him, gotta thank him all, gotta thank him all, our Patreons! If y'all remember last time, we learned that Missile also has the powers of the dead. Yeah! Uh, but his moment. powers are slightly different than ours. Uh, he can reach farther, and he can swap things. It's cool. Does that yeah. mean like you get that power or you have to like swap between them and do it? Well, we'll find out. We'll find out. All right. All right. Let's get started. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> when did the bridge end and when did the sizzle begin? We'll never know. <laughs> Four minutes from now, you'll swap Mino with the leaf. And then you have to swap Mino with something else. Something with the same <laughs> shape. Oh, I believe, I believe that's a rugby ball. Okay, rugby ball. Yeah, uh -huh. sure, that's a fucking rugby ball. <laughs> I mean, it, it, it is, it is. And rugby, and rugby would be more popular in Japan than, than football. Do we have any indication of where this game is set? No, Japan or foreign, yeah. Ghost trick. Yeah, yeah. Realm. Ghost trick realm. Yeah. Gr With the rugby ghost. ball where it is now, missile can't reach it. So that means I have to move it closer somehow. It looks like you and I will have to work together on that one, Missile. Okay, I'm ready. Whenever you want to use my swap trick, just touch the missile icon. <laughs> <laughs> that way, you'll be able to control me. And then, if you touch the sizzle icon... <laughs> Control will come back to me. 
by the way, you can switch between us with select too. Ah, uh, yes, the select button on my spicy DS. Very big uh, button. Mm -hmm. So select, huh? I'll remember that. Okay, let's try it. Together, we can stop Mino from hurting anybody. Or we can just let the weird park guy die. I, I don't think we're missing much, honestly. <laughs> All right, Missile. Your powers are the key this time. Okay, I'm ready. I can swap anything that has the same shape. Just call on me if you want to. If, if you find anything you want to try. Probably the best thing to do is just try a bunch of things and see how it goes. I don't know. Just push buttons. <laughs> I don't know. Just play the game, I guess. <laughs> and if I see something we can swap, I should use the missile icon. All right. Swap, swap Camilla out oh, of the yeah. way with the, 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 the murder right. guy. They're the same shape. Uni Uni's verse throw. is right. We, the only reason we're saving the park guy is because uh, the box also got crushed along with him. That's true. Which I completely forgot. The box is fine. Oh, she do. Mm. Huh? Are you coming back to talk to me again? Uh, no. <laughs> I... Well, this is awkward. I wish you would talk to me! We could discuss the gods! Oh, boy. I just came this way without giving it much thought. But now, wow, you can lose this. Wow, you can lose this level in one move, guys. <laughs> for now, there's no core for me to get back. You failed to follow the path of the gods! Okay, you weird evangel evangelical. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I better start over. Alright, well that was a real lowercase g gamer moment. Wow. Where I literally had to restart after making one yeah. move. <laughs> That's pretty rough, Lowercase g gamer. That's rough, dude. <laughs> That is hey, uh, you know, objectively kind of rough. Did you know when you die, you can do ghost tricks? It's great. <laughs> Nothing so I can do there. Dogs. Open this Lydia closer to the tire. Tire. <laughs> I want to try something really quickly. Can you inhabit? Oh, you can't. Oh. It's gonna make you talk. Oh. What I want to try is I just, I just want to see the bounds of this swapping thing. Okay. Hundred yes. percent bridge. All right, all right. I can move the tire to that side. Uh oh. No. Bridge oh god, this is gonna be so confusing. Super ghost trick pro. Yeah, they definitely like kind of amp the. The well, puzzle I, thoughts you have to have in the. I wonder if they could have used like a different way to <laughs> show that you're in like sizzle mode, please. It's too heavy. The seesaw won't budge. Maybe because of the swap I made. I guess a little ball is about all the weight I can handle. Damn. Okay. Sizzle, do you even lift? Why do you work? <laughs> I forgot how ridiculous this fucking. Pop them back, because that was an oopsie doodle. Classic oopsie doodle move. Whew. Here you come already. I swore to myself not to repeat my mistakes. Mistakes? When somebody's in trouble, you should lend them a hand. Otherwise, you'll definitely regret it. And now, the recklessness of youth has taken over, giving me lightning fast speed! So that's how Carl was able to outrun all those seventh graders. <laughs> it was the recklessness of youth. Uh, I hope Carl's still in the chat. <laughs> hmm, I've been thinking. If we could stop this man from running, maybe he wouldn't get squished. It won't be easy to stop me once the recklessness of youth has taken over. Stop him, eh? Uh, okay. 
amazing that, you know, Sissel's already worse at dirt tricking than the dog is. Our boys come a long way. Oh? Oh my god. Can you get to the paper up at the top of left to get up to the tree? Is that, like, what that's Yeah. Called? I'm wondering, though, does he jump on the... Seesaw? Yeah, does he use the seesaw? If I swap now, can I screw him up from getting there? I mean... I'm gonna I'm try it. We'll see what happens if he tries to make that jump. I can't remember. I can't remember what. Oh, look at the timing! <laughs> A love letter. But you gotta I mean... wrestle a rub letter. Oh. <gasps> Okay. Being a dialogue thing. What do you think of my lightning fast pace? I wish you would knock it off. That's what I think. <laughs> we don't have time to prepare. I think we're going to have to find a way to stop him from running. As far as I can see, the only way to do that is to use the playground equipment. The what? Oh my god, Sissel, dude. The what? You know, the seesaw, the swing, those things. Precisely. I don't know what a seesaw is. <laughs> Except, there is one more piece of equipment to be exact. Hmm. Stop him with the equipment, eh? Maybe I should rethink things here. <laughs> Lithium well. says, I don't see a saw. Before that. <laughs> I've seen Saul before. Though, so. Do you want to play a game? Look at this funny flattened ball! It's the same shape as that horrible Mino! But it's too far to swap from here! Even this ball is starting to look horrible to me! Hmm. We have to find a way to get this ball closer to that Mino thing. Knock it down from the tree, I say! There must be something we can do. No oh, shit. Oh! That was so close! If you hit the ball, it could have knocked it down! Is that all this umbrella can be used for? Oh. For knocking the rugby ball down? Dun, dun, dun. Don't forget about my powers! Puppy powers! <laughs> and don't forget about my recklessness of youth! So you can open it again. But you can't get back up to the love letter. What happens if you open it again? I know we're on this league. Hmm. You have to open it while it's in the middle of fall, like before it falls? Damn. Oh no. What else can, can, uh, basketball missile do? Probably swap. You can swap the basketball with the tire. Probably wreck that shit. Because missile can probably reach to the. How, I'm curious how, like, what well, we already know is range is too short for. I, I think you have to get the basketball swap with the tire, wreck the fucking round thing so he, he gets fucked up. Or something close to that. Uh, Coffee Boar just subscribed. Thank you very much. Oh, that's me. Can't reach the swing. Well, when he's swinging on it, you can. It goes forward. Ah, oh, good point. Eventually, I just that's really early in the cycle, though, is what I'm like. Wow. I mean, you, it's that it's all about that recklessness of youth. Splash. Ah, oh, shoot. Sorry. Uh, Hedge's <laughs> corner. Thank you for the gift. It's a coffee board. Sizzle, help! 
There's nothing in reach to swap Mino with! That's a shame. We're too late. Darn. I guess we'll have to start over again. <laughs> it's like six six years later, Sissel's still like, I'm trying to ghost trick this night. I can't solve this. Alright, what are we thinking, team? Uh, you gotta swap something with something. To stop him from getting to where he's going. I think you have to get as far right as you can with both people so you can see more because he starts moving pretty quickly. I but think I do, I, I, I do legitimately think you might need to swap with the basketball. With if the I if I remember correctly, there is something you can swap that you haven't considered yet, but we'll see. Maybe the maybe the playground thing itself because it's round as well. Well, would you look at that? Yeah. Sure are a lot of things. <laughs> there are a lot of round things around here. What are you trying to say? Oh boy! That means it's time for me, right? Oh boy! My hair is also round! Zach, do you like having two high-pitched characters talk to each other? No, it sucks, dude. <laughs> I can't wait for this guy to be out of the game so we can just so I can just focus on doing says or missile's voice. Let's see. To use missile's power, I have to touch the missile button icon. I'll try and see what happens. Okay. Missile. Let's move along. Moving along. Alright, it's thinking like I should try and swap these first. We're well, already over there, right? You're already oh, past No way. Hold on, actually. Can I. I would. Yeah, hold on. Move this. Now, go to Missile. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He moves very quickly. Oh, I think you gotta get Sissel out of the way. Unless you can jump. Oh my god, the range is crazy. That's pretty crazy. What is there to do here? Well, he might swing back and then you can see more, but I just don't know. I don't think the swing is important, but I can't remember. Oh. Yeah, it was fine. Yeah, I did that. Yeah. Are they gonna tell you that every single time? Damn. Yeah, that's a that's a game that's... made before. That's a game made before 2008. Everybody. What happened in 2008? You <laughs> made skippable. The, the great the great instruction crisis. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> the incident. Never forget Twilight Princess has like. Oh fucking... my god. I, I like that game, and it still has a really long tutorial. So obviously, when he jumps on there, I'm going to be able to get Sissel to there. Correct. But is there really anything else I can do with did Missile? You, did you try point? swapping the playground thing? It's as stupid as it sounds. It's round. But, like, with what, though? Yeah, I, 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 don't, I, don't, I, I don't I know. was thinking that... I was thinking that would work too, Jason. It doesn't look like it will. Okay, if you can't swap it, that's that's a, that's that's fine. I just didn't know if since it was round, if it would let you just fucking. Now, right now, the only round things are just this tire, baseball, and basketball. It's a sports extravaganza. I don't know. See what happens if the tires in the thing. Just let yeah. them let them play it out. Let them play, ref. I, I will say you right. probably want you definitely want to get Sissel up there. Yeah, you're gonna want to when you get a chance, but he can't yet until he st he starts spinning on it. Oh yeah, good point. Unfortunately, unfortunate, but yeah. Oh, shut up, Sissel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can only move it if it's the tiny ball. Oh fucking! 
The dog is in there too, so you can't move. No, he's not. No, Sissel's uh, up in the football. No, but the dog's in the oh. tire. Oh, okay. oh wait, I forgot. Sissel fix the fuck. I, I. Do you want Sissel to be in the football preemptively or no? Or you're trying to swap the thing so you it breaks. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Somehow you have to get the you have to get the the guy to stop the rugby yeah. ball to move out of the tree because it's too it's too heavy. All right, it, it it's too far away from the. Well, you knock it with the umbrella when it's open, right? He said something like, "I, you can, I don't, you can... I don't think it did anything though." Oh, okay. But he did say, is there another use for the umbrella? So I don't know about Correct. that. Yeah. Yeah, get the love letter up there. Just moves it up a little bit. Which will get you access to the other stuff. Oh my god. Oh, he flings the baseball, knocks the football. That's it. He'll fling the football. Oh, the baseball. That, that's a good. That's a good. I, yeah, I think that's how you good do guess. it. Good guess. I think you have to get the the baseball on the thing, fling it, knock the football down. Yeah. And then the football. Yeah, then uh, I, this. Yeah, that blocks me into something, so I can't do anything there. I think that's what you would have to do. But I think the umbrella might not have to be because you might be able to hit the umbrella with a baseball too. What it's something? Oh, probably, yeah. Maybe maybe you have to knock the umbrella hit. down to. No, if you you wouldn't be able to knock the umbrella down before he makes that jump. Uh, mm, I, don't, I don't think. I, I, don't know, I, 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 I bet don't you know could. It'd be tight, but I bet you could. I don't know the time window. Yeah, it seems like this is a really tight one, which is annoying because the guy starts moving like instantly. It feels like. But if you knock the umbrella down, he'll probably get hit by it and stop running? Question mark? I don't know. Okay. Boom. Boom. I already foresee having like an extra person, like not being able to get their soul kind of sucks though. I, or you can't have them the same thing. That kind of blows. Come on. Sissel. The incident. No guys, the incident. The tutorial incident. Did you read all the dialogue boxes that I said? No. Yes. Oops. You clicked yes, even though you meant no. I will repeat okay. all this information. Again. Um. So the here's the thing about using the baseball to knock it up. The baseball is already there. Yeah. So but it you... feel weird that I shouldn't change anything. And can. Sissel moves. Oh. Can you move anything up in the? Oh my god. Get in, get in there with Sissel again. Well, I was thinking missile power could be up in the. Check. Oh, you wait, can spin it. Wait. You can, you can spin yep. it. You can spin yep. it. You can spin it. I didn't even see that. Yeah. No, I feel stupid for not seeing that either. Yeah. I mean. Oh, uh, you can spin this faster. Yeah. yeah check, uh, there you go. go. You, you got to be at the center. Oh, the center. Yeah. I didn't even see oh, that. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god! What the fuck! I'm gonna kill this man! Wow! I didn't see this coming. No, Same I system. did it. Don't you know the first thing about the globe climber? Huh? Even little children treat it with the dis with, with the respect it deserves. They know that unless you spin it gently, there's no stopping it. I guarantee you children do not respect that. <sighs> yeah, it does look pretty dangerous. It looks like I'm just destined to fly through the air like this for a while. Hmm. This just might buy us some time. I don't know why I said it like that. Yeah, I was like, wait, what? Is there a joke? Wow, nice. I like the pun. <laughs> this might just buy us some time. No, no, no. It might buy us some time. <laughs> I don't know why I thought buy was a pun. <laughs> it was a good one, though. Maybe he'll just keep spinning around like this for the whole four minutes. 
I'm sorry, but I don't think I would stand for that long. <laughs> I don't think I would stand for it that long. But anyway, at least okay. we stopped him from running for a while. So that's how you're gonna get up to the umbrella. Yeah, okay. Let's do, let's do what we can while we have the chance. Okay, so now I can knock you can the umbrella. You just kill him in a different way. Yeah, you could probably get the umbrella. Yeah. Knocked out. Do you want do you want missile up in the football right now or no? Preemptively. I don't before think before you yet. knock it down. Uh, I mean, maybe. I don't, I don't think it matters because we get that this doesn't take any time off the clock. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So I can. I mean, I can have him up there. Oh my gosh! Shut up, missile. <laughs> hey. Fuck you. I'm a top Pomeranian. Uh, okay, okay, now they can shut up, actually. <laughs> uh, Alright, close it. this. Does anything want to open it again? Can... Oh, now when he gets the thing, he'll, it might catch it now. There you go. Oh... But the foot, that thing is not heavy enough. Wow. No, wait. But. <gasps> you could swap it up? Oh, okay. What if I were to swap something? Bigger. Wait, can you? Oh, I don't oh. know. Oh, no, but am I? It's... The tire needs to be over here. Yeah, that sucks. But that's just the, yeah. Oh, we don't know that yet. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we do. It's, There's no way the tire's it's... not too far away. Yeah. Yeah, it's got to be the tire. That's. Yeah, oh, to, I mean, try try things, save. try things. Really? I don't know. What what happens if you try to to interact with the umbrella now as a sizzle? Yeah, swapping that does nothing. Sizzle. Oh, that's a good point. I didn't think about that. I'm gonna try to close the umbrella. Oh. That's a little oh, sorry. unlucky. The umbrella won't close, will it? The ball must be in the way. Oh well, I guess we don't have to close it. Yeah, we just let this guy die, it's not a big deal. I'm with his whistle. That's fine. Wow, I so did not see that coming. <laughs> I never thought the umbrella would catch the ball. <laughs> did you see that? The tree branch, it shook a little. I think I saw it shake too. Shake, shake. Shake, shake. <laughs> if only it shook a little bit more. It would knock that terrible rugby ball down from this terrible tree. Maybe it just needs a little more weight. I'm sure we can do this. We just have to put our heads together. Everything looks good so Damn. far. We just need one more step. Uh, so with that save state I had was this? Yeah, it's just still yes. good. Actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you want uh, to swap the? Yeah, Sissel, get out of the ball for a second. But you, you yeah, you can't fling the tire because I assume that's just bad. No, we yeah, need the tire to, won't yeah, get high need, enough. But it we need to have the basketball bad. swung. We need to flip the basketball into the umbrella, yes. then swap Correct. the basketball with the tire. Correct. Perfect. Okay. Missile. That moves all of that moves all of them around too at one point. Yeah. Now missile. Can stay up here for now. Oh my god. We'll listen to the dialogue one more time. Tutorial incident of 2008. Damn it. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> <laughs> Obama I remember get Obama's campaign office like slogan. I will limit my, my, my fellow Americans. I will my fellow uh, <laughs> limit tutorials <laughs> in video games. Yeah, will, tutorials have gone on for I will I will create term limits and limits to tutorials, my fellow Americans. <laughs> Once you see the tutorial, you will not be forced to read it again. <laughs> the Kingdom Hearts franchise will never be the same. <laughs> you right, so now I just here. wait for Where it to jump I? on it, right? Yeah, jump on it. Spin it. Jump on it. Oh, nice. One Spin his ass. Holy shit. Oh my god, he's so oh good. Oh my god, he's this so guy is... Good. <laughs> Bridge really literally couldn't timing. have gone faster. Speed run of Ghost Trick, nice. Fastest ghost 
We're, we're gonna we're gonna start a new category in games done quick. It's speed running, but it's voice acted speed running. Oh my god. Oh, that'd be fun. <laughs> It's speed running, but you have to read all the voice clips. <laughs> you, you, we call it the rain rain pace any percent. Because in a theater, they call it rain pace when you go through the play fast, because it's like tied to outdoor summer theaters that used to do shows, and they would be like, oh, we have to... There's a storm coming. We have to finish the game. We, we have to finish the uh, the play before the end of the stream, or else the, the audience gets half their money back. So they're like, okay, rain pace, rain pace, folks. Start reading your lines really quickly. Shakes a little bit. Uh-huh. But now... Oh, Go baby, we swap in. in. Coming to get you. Oh. Is that enough? Yep. Okay. There. We move the ball. What do you think, Missile? Nah, I'm not into this. <laughs> well, with the ball there, I think I can do it. In just a few seconds, you'll swap Mino with the leaf. Oh! Oh! And then from there, you can swap Mino one more time. The final moment is near. Missile, are you ready? You bet! Swap me, baby. One Top one. Pomeranian! Yes. Missile. Missiles are there. And then you just have to wait. Just don't fuck up the timing. Uh, uh. Yeah, he can't be anywhere else, right? No, nah, yeah, yeah. I, I think it's it waiting, it. waiting for waiting for past missile to do this. Yeah, I think. This is so fucking weird. Yeah, it is, it is actually, you're, you're fucking with a death that you already fucked with, yeah. Right. <laughs> Shweem. Yep. Oh, baby. Okay, watch me, Sissel. Here I go. Finishing touches. You can do it, Missile. Swap Mina with that ball. Nah, I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah, fuck, nerds. fuck that guy. I just realized I hate him. <laughs> Absolutely destroyed. It'd be so funny if it just leaned over and smushed him still. <laughs> There! How's that? My head has been spared. Truly, that was a try worthy of the gods. And now, Mino is right where he belongs. Wow, way to call that piece of sculpture what? trash. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? What? what the <laughs> You know, that person he was just Mino? called the Lorax trash, you guys. Mino killed my father. <laughs> he just called the legally distinct Lorax trash. <laughs> we did it again, didn't we? Didn't we? Nobody had. No, nobody has to die. Except for you, Missile. Well, shit. Except oh, for one yeah, brave little well. somebody. Huh? I'm talking about you, Missile. Oh, me. I guess you're right. I'm still dead, aren't I? So now, let's go back and say- Oh! Your life. Wait a minute. Oh. What is it? Now that I think about it, I think I want to stay dead a little longer. That's a mood missile. What? <laughs> oh, Jesus. When I was alive, I couldn't even help Miss Camilla when she was in trouble. <laughs> I want to be able to protect Miss Camilla. And to do that, I need the powers I have now. I see. God, missile's theme is so good. Perfectly understandable. Look, my only problem with missile's theme 
is for some reason, it sounds like it's out of a one of the Honey Pop games. Uh, I've never played them, so I don't hear that. That's unfortunate for you, Bridge. I know. Yeah, that is I that know. is a little <laughs> impure, we'll say. The purity went down a little bit with that yeah. one. It's not, it's not great. <laughs> I'm not a proud man. People in chat are like, Preach, no. Yes, I played both Honey Pop games. What do you want to do about it? <laughs> Big whoop, want to fight? Did you, you you played Honey Pop 2 on release. <laughs> that's, that's true. <laughs> Even I wish I had powers like that. Hey, we just saved you. Don't wish your life away already. Oh, of course. You're right. <laughs> Sophie says Bridge speedruns both Honey Pop games. He does the does the one-handed no, speedrun. No, no, because then you're missing out on all that amazing dialogue in those games. I'm sorry, my joke Bobby. was good. You no, so Zach, you can't say that, man. <laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> yes, I can. You cannot. That was a fucking good joke. That was a good joke. You just can't say that. <laughs> That's bannable. <laughs> it's not bannable. It's a joke. <laughs> we make way too many Zack Tuesday nights. Yeah, you know, come on, come on. Bannable? No, that could be just him having a good <laughs> innocent time. God damn it. Oh, of course. You're right. <laughs> okay, missile. Have it your way. It's like a Burger King. <laughs> Soapy describing Honey Pop is Honey Pop is a bejeweled sex crossover. <laughs> oh yes, the 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 sex franchise, my favorite franchise. Or as the Zerp, or as the Zerp Boy Man puts it, Honey Pop is basically Candy Crush, but the reward is sex. Oh, that's also really good. Which once again is accurate. I mean, both are pretty sweet. So. Uh, King Kieran has his Honey Pop banned on Twitch. Uh, it actually has a safer work mode, so technically yeah, it is safer work mode. You can turn you can turn off all nudity, so it's just spicy, but not. But not, in a but not, too, but not like our DS. Not, not like our yeah. DS, though. That thing's <laughs> that one's really playing with playing with the embers right there. <laughs> that one's also questionably legal. When we get back to the present time, <laughs> could you give it to her? Certainly, you have my word. Let's go back then to the present. No, back to the future, missile. Come on. You're chewing the reference raw. <laughs> <laughs> and just twirling the leaf. <laughs> and so, Camilla ended up in the hands of the kidnappers. We weren't able to change that part. Lynn listened to my story without saying anything. I'm sorry. I wish there was something else I could have done. Did get mad at you? Oh, okay, there, we're good. We're good. Lynn, thank you. <laughs> no, you, you did the best you could. I'm... Sure, she's all right. After all. After all, she has me. Huh? Also, Lynn has probably never heard the voice of Missile, right? Yeah. But she Missile? can apparently guess. Yeah. Are you in there? I mean, I guess if Magnus started speaking in my head, I would have to assume that I would recognize his voice instantly. Although I don't know what it would be. What if it was like a hundred hey, percent hey, different hey, Zach, than what you up, thought? Dude? Yeah, I was like, "Hey man, how hey, you doing? Man. <laughs> hey man, it's me, it's your boy <laughs> Magnus. It's Magnus. It's your tiny boy Magnus. <laughs> Thanks it's for you. all the head pats and belly it, rubs and treats. It's your favorite little man, the child of it's prophecy, you. Magnus. <laughs> it's me, hey. Miss Lynn. Leave Miss Camilla to me. I don't know. I, I know I don't look like much right now." But I'm sure I can help her. <laughs> People are saying Chadness, and I so, hate that. <laughs> hey! No! no! Miss Lynn! <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> Wait, Wynn's truly the big enemy of this game, then. Wow. Uh, what the fuck? Go get the dog! What? <laughs> what the fuck, Lynn? <laughs> I'm gonna leave it up to Missile. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> it kind of looks like Missile is being left up to the wind. Uh, what, what if uh, you can't jump to enough things to get away? She's, she's just like you could say Missile is gone with the wind. Ah, 
Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. Hey, that was good, Axe. That was good, Zach. Oh. I have something to give you. It's a leaflet about saving this park. <laughs> Fuck. It was. Oh, wow. Man. You absolutely got him. Stop the park from something. I'm sorry, Zach. You're good. <laughs> you boomed aren't me. You for, aren't you forgetting your promise? Oh, pardon me, pardon me. <clears throat> My apologies. This is for you. Don't you love it when strange guy when strange guys in parks hand you boxes with a gun in them? <laughs> That's true. I forgot there was a gun in the box. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, that okay. definitely fit in that pocket. No uh -huh. way. What is this? A fucking whatever, man. It's a trench coat. Yeah, sure. You kept the music box safe, didn't you? Thank you. Not at all. I was only doing what the. I was only doing what the rock of the gods. Uh, would have wanted. Uh... What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? Dude, so he might have a concussion, bro. <laughs> He's mesmerized by my beauty! God damn He's Lynn. concussed. <laughs> wow, this so is just best fucking best roasting best best so best hard. That's dialogue prop in the entire thing. Hey, the cat's not allowed to get your tongue! <sighs> Just fall over already. God damn, dude. No, okay, he's not gonna do that. I excuse me, but are you? No, it couldn't be. Have we met before? Are you the child of prophecy? Aren't <laughs> you? I swear to God, he says this exact. It's... Oh my God. Aren't you that little girl from that time? Wow, ghost trick. I'll never forget it. It was ten years ago in this park. Ten years ago? Uh, are you talking about the DL6 incident? <laughs> no, Wait, no, we can't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Zach, throw that Yanni Yogi in the elevator picture. Okay, done. <laughs> Let me edit. Fuck, I hope I remember to edit that part in. Here, in this park, the gods surely control fate. Today, ten years from that day, we meet once again. If that isn't the power of the gods, then what else is it? It could just be coincidence. Okay, we're like shit, man. But apparently, you know our late detective here. Could you tell us about it? About what happened ten years ago? Yes! Yes, of course! I was actually about to do just that! We gotta... What's this Rock of the Gods you keep mentioning? It's a really awesome music tournament! Don't you know? It's right there! In front of us! I said music tournament instead of music festival, which is a wild choice of words. I, thought, I mean, I thought it was like a battle of the band sort of thing. So yeah, maybe. Oh, that works too. God damn oh, it. No. Oh. Missile. Lynn, you literally let the leaf holding missile soul I let blow the leaf in the wind. go. <laughs> Wait a minute. You say G O D S, but do you mean. D O G S? No, I know what dogs and gods are. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know. <laughs> don't be silly. This is no time for ridiculous word games. You are standing just above the rock of the gods now. Take a good look at that monument. Well done, well done. I had to. For doing crossover jokes. Mon Oh, 
Rock God. of the Gods, Tamsik Park. <laughs> it genuinely says that. The Rock of the Gods. The rock is buried in the ground right here. It's been there these ten years. Ever since that day, it flew down from the heavens and showed us a miracle. A miracle. The miracle did. The miracle never happened. <laughs> Fuck. So he said mistakes in the miracle. Mistakes in the miracle. Rock you've been talking about. Is a meteorite. Precisely. It dropped from the sky that day ten years ago. Yes, of course. Surely you know all about it. Me? Also, uh, back to your ten bit saying, I don't know how to read, but I know you're full of shit. Sizzle. <laughs> Uh, and traveling in a box tier 10 bits, uh, a little bit ago saying, uh, when, when missile was there saying, I'm a leaf in a wind, I'm a leaf in the wind. Watch how I fly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Antelus tier 20 bits saying, Pridge, I just want to say based as fuck. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's when you were talking about honey pop. Uh, honey pop yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that day, I just happened to be passing through the park. I had no idea that day would change my destiny. The sun was going down, and through the gloom, I heard the scream of a little girl. <laughs> exactly like that. Uh, and this is Jack. Now, just calm down and drop the weapon. Uh, Stay back! If you come any closer, oh, I'll shoot her. Is this your character we know? Or I uh, just, we, we don't know, know them yet, but Pridge, you, yeah, voicing them is good. Okay. I peeked out fearly, fearfully from the bushes and saw some shadowy figures. I didn't see the face of the criminal clearly. I knew I should do something to help, but I couldn't move. The tension was so thick, it was painful. And just, when I... <laughs> and just when I couldn't stand it any longer, that's when it happened. The sky suddenly burned bluish white. Literally the most unfortunate like hostage what? taking of all time. Dude just got... Fucked. Bro, that would fucking destroy like this like city. By the way, <laughs> there's like th there's like three meteorites in one. <laughs> well, it scatters, you know. Oh, when okay. It, when it crashed into the ground, the meteorite gave off a shower of beautiful fragments, and then I saw it. One of those beautiful fragments. Pierced into the criminal's back. Damn. The judgment of the gods was brought down on the park that day. Ten years ago, that little girl was, was you. The little girl that was you was saved by the Rock of the Gods. Oh my! I can't believe it! Wait, Lynn, do you not know that? Maybe she yes, passed not. out or something? Yeah, I, don't just, I don't know. Yeah. Sure. Like, not in there. Uh... The Rock of the Gods was given the name Temsic because Nilbog is goblin spelled backwards. <laughs> and still today. It lies sleeping deep in the park's earth. <laughs> I I never knew about this Tamsik. I, I always thought Detective Jowd was the one who saved me. Well, he's no longer my hero. 
<laughs> you were very young then. And you passed out from the shock of being taken hostage. How of course, old is you Lin? wouldn't remember. Yeah, how old is this person? Yeah, like, is Lin... I would, I would have assumed Lin was over 18, but I guess fucking not. Uh, I mean, I, I assume... Mean, uh, yeah, it makes the tracks. Lin's probably like a 10-year-old I mean, she could have been 10 and fallen unconscious and not yeah. remember what happened. Yeah. She could be so. mid... She could be low 20s. I mean, I'd say a teenager would still pass out after being kidnapped. But that's funny. Like, ha-ha <laughs> funny. <laughs> like clown funny? What are you talking like about? clown funny, yeah. <laughs> A huge incident like that should have caused quite a stir. It's strange you never heard of it, Lin. It is, isn't it? But now that I think about it, I remember I didn't want it to think about what happened. I avoided the news and I never came back to this park again. That's why I didn't know anything about it. The meteorite was named Temsic, after the name of this park that it fell in. And then, the Rock of the Gods was forgotten. I genuinely forgot that this character had so much dialogue in this, this game. Guy, yeah, I know, this right? Guy, I'm, this I'm surprised he's so relevant. I, yeah. I, yeah, this guy's way more important than I thought he would be. Yeah. Chicken Girl deserves way more than this dude. A hundred percent. Justice for Chicken Girl. <laughs> Now, an awful thing is happening. They're talking about turning the park into a housing site. They're at housing as hostage site. Like, what? Wow. Into what a hostage be? site. Wow, this is again. Really, this, this really is pre-2008 if we want more housing market. The price is <laughs> great. Thanks, Obama. I'll never forget the miracle I witnessed that day. Obama was elected president. <laughs> 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 and all tutorial was cut from games. <laughs> At least now we know the exact date of these events. <laughs> it's the exact day Obama was elected. <laughs> and so, I've taken up residence in this park, and I'm trying to appeal to the people. Protect the park, the rock of the gods. That is my mission. Change you can believe in. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Damn, that Rick Warren is has said. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm taking you with me, missile. That's like lo low key kind of fucked. It's <laughs> so fucking. I mean, I don't know. I, I guess it'd be worse to just leave the dog's yeah, dead body yeah, there. Yeah, I like, think that's the, it's, just, it's weird, but it's probably better than yeah. just leaving yeah. it there. Also, if she picks up, picks up the body, does the core move with it? Or? No, no, the core is always where you die. Okay, okay, just making sure. Just making sure. Yeah, the core is always where your life has stopped. Where your I don't know mm -hmm. your. Whatever we qualify as death yeah. in this game, she brain had, function stops. She literally heart had stops. missile in her hands. It's like ah, fuck it, the leaf's gone. As long like, whatever that <laughs> as long as she doesn't, as long as she doesn't put it in the other pocket, yeah. then I'm gonna be pissed. So ten years ago, the little girl that was Lynn wasn't aware of the meteorites. I get that, but Detective Jowd, on the other hand, there's no way he didn't know about this hemsick thing. And if he knew. And the man died. I took his life. What was that confession of his all about? Yeah, Jout's whole confession was like, yeah, hey, I killed a man who was holding a girl hostage. Yeah, I'm a terrible was... person. I should never be forgiven. Now he even has less of a leg to stand on. Man, Jow keeps trying to take the blame for killing people and not having killed them. Yeah. <laughs> I killed this guy. No, you didn't. I, I killed my wife. No, I, you didn't. I'm an astrologist. I saw that meteorite was coming. I, I killed, killed that guy. Next, next, I mean, next we're going to be like, I was the one who killed JFK. <laughs> it was me. I was the second Jow. shooter on the grassy knoll. <laughs> I was the second shooter on the grassy knoll. God damn it. How do we keep coming back to that joke? I killed him with a rude Goldberg design, device <laughs> from the Grassy Knoll. <laughs> I, what's uh, what's the name of the fucking spell that uh, what's Sephiroth uses? Is it actually just called Meteorite? Uh, 
I think me. Is it just Zephyrath? Yeah. Just meteor? Is it just meteor? I think it might be. It is. Yeah, it's just, just meteor. meteor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. David convert. It's just meteor. The rock of the gods that fell from the sky ten years ago changed the destinies of many people's lives. Like the ripple on a pond when a rock of the gods is dropped in. <laughs> With every answer I get, I learn about a new mystery. Will I be able to break the chain of mysteries before the last four chapters are done? <laughs> anyway. Now that we have the evidence we need, we decide to meet up at the, again at the minister's office. Besides, there are a few things I want to ask Detective Chow. I hope you're ready to do a couple old guy voices again, Zach. <laughs> Chow, minister office. Guy yeah. Again. Well, at least, at least they're like baritone voices now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, fucking deserved by man shared five bits and said, "You jest, but Lim was literally killed by a second shooter on the trashy knoll." Which, hey. Dessert Boy Man, 10 out of 10 joke. That's good. <laughs> we found the music box, Detective Jow. Good job, Lynn. I knew oh. you would. Ellipses. Once everything had been resolved, I had wanted you to give this to him. Him? You mean Inspector Cabanella, right? I don't suppose he'll ever forgive me. Detective Chow. Now then, let's get this thing open. There's a certain knack to doing it, you know. Knack, the game for the PlayStation 3. Oh shit, he's just gonna rip it. <laughs> See? He calls that a knack? Looks, a, looks, looks more like Knack 3 to me. <laughs> looks more like Sackboy's Big Adventure. <laughs> looks more like Fruit Strength to me. That did not fit in there. What the fuck? He just flipped that. That. Also, yeah, that was don't not go big off, enough. Don't go off, don't go off, don't go off, don't go off. You should find scorch marks on the grip. Scorch marks? I'm a detective. When Camilla built her contraption, she used a special kind of string. It's a kind magicians use, and burns up in an instant and disappears. <clears throat> Why would little Camilla use something like that? She was crazy about Chris Angel. She kept Mind running around freak. the house saying, You got mind freaked, Dad! And then I'd have to pretend to... That I had been mind freaked. Yeah. <laughs> the truth was, I was never actually mind freaked. It was, it was actually kind of annoying, but cute at the same time. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe because she's a detective's daughter. Not leaving any evidence behind and all that. <laughs> in the case of, in the case report, there was mentions of some scorch marks. When it happened, uh, I'm assuming this is Jow. When it happened, yeah. Camilla was watching from her hiding place. She saw the flame run to the gun, something she naturally didn't include in her design. I took the gun out of the frame and replaced it with a picture. If you remove the picture, you should find scorch marks behind it on the frame, too. And those marks should match up with the ones on the gun. In other words... It proves the contraption that... It, it proves the contraption existed there in that room that day. Hmm. And it didn't work the way your little girl intended, is that right? No, my daughter did not intend to shoot her mom. <laughs> exactly. Some cowardly culprit modified the design. Some ghost tricked it. <laughs> but that angle was never brought up in court. Yeah, no shit, dog. Yeah, how are you gonna- Nobody's gonna be like, that? oh, ghost trick. There was a ghost trick. Hey, Pritch, as a lawyer, would ghost trick be a viable defense? <laughs> 
You know, if I ever become a defense attorney, I will try <laughs> Ghost Trick on my first case. Okay. It will also be my last case because I will be immediately disbarred. Also, uh, huge shout outs to whoever that defendant gets to be. Sorry, dog, you're going to jail. <laughs> I need to test something on you. <laughs> you're right being my guinea pig. I want to try something. Your Honor, Ghost Tricks. Mm. <laughs> Ghost and Tricks. What if we merge the ideas together? You know, the what? plot twist: okay. the judge was the judges shoot Takumi. <laughs> oh shit! I love this idea. This is good. <laughs> Innocent. <laughs> Kate, trial over. And so, as justice minister, I must call off the execution at this point. Do it's right. Wasn't Detective Jowd? Now we can finally prove that! Hell. Thank goodness. Thank you, Lin. In those eyes of yours, I see the eyes of that little girl from ten years ago. Hey, speaking of that... <laughs> yeah, good transition, Jowd. Yeah, thanks for that transition, Jowd. Um, <laughs> uh, I just courted you a bit saying, Bro, my lawyer got a one in ethics. I'm going to jail. <laughs> uh, and Hedges cornered you a bit saying, Scorch marks. Uh, another, another one bit saying, Scorch marks like that are ballistic markings, which are like the fingerprints of a gun. <clears> hmm. <throat> What's the matter? I just don't know. What should I have done five years ago? Why do kids love the taste of Cinnamon Toast Crunch? <laughs> That's good. Speaking of, uh, Zero Tearless this Thursday, folks. Back then, nobody had any way of knowing the true nature of the manipulator. It wasn't anybody's fault that we didn't know the truth. Do you really think so? Of course. Besides... What's important right now is deciding what to do next. Am I right? <laughs> Am I right, fellas? <laughs> She's right, Mr. Minister. Uh, yes, yes, of course. I do believe she is. Hmm. What is it now? I just don't know. <laughs> what should I do next? You'll figure it out. We believe in you. Deserve boy mentioned five bits saying if cinnamon toast crunch is any lower than S tier, I'm unsubbing. It's S, S plus tier for me, buddy. Don't worry, it's my favorite. Really? Cereal of all. Yep, it's my really? favorite. Really? Yes. Perfect shape. It's it goes into the milk. It gets a little cinnamon residue it in the milk. It goes into the milk. After. That's literally every cereal. No, but the cinnamon. I know what you mean. I, I need a decent amount of cereal dry, dude. I know yeah. what you mean. Uh, yeah. Well, you'll have to tune in on Thursday and find out. Yeah. Sissel, if you hadn't come to my cell tonight, I would be gone by now without ever having known any of, any of this. Hey, why were you painting my picture? This is what I deserve. Hey, why were you painting my picture? Because <laughs> you're just like one of my French girls. Damn it. That's what I told I myself all these past five years. But things are different now. If a miracle would happen. Thanks to you, my eyes have finally been opened. Tonight, I've come into contact with a lot of people's lives and got involved in their fates. And the only reason I was doing it was to regain my own lost memory. But things are different now. We're connected to each other. I just know it. And that's why I need to ask you a few more questions in order to find the truth about us. Fair enough. Fire away. <clears throat> I definitely noticed a theme with Ghost Trick in the past two to three chapters of like this this kind of thing happening. You're in a ghost fucking voice and you're just talking for like three prompts and you learn so much. <laughs> yeah, the, the, yeah. The, the way they dump exposition back, it's, is it's the pacing back, can be weird. Yeah. yeah. 
Sissel told me all about it, Detective Jowled. About the manipulator. Yes. And it looks like the manipulator really did a number on the minister, too. Ugh. Please don't pick on the minister. He dies again. <laughs> I'm the one who has to save him. Ugh. Sissel, do you think... Do you think that's what happened to me, too? Ah. Hmm? Well, what are you talking about, Lin? Which of the six deaths are you talking about? Don't tell me. You were manipulated, too! I mean, literally... Oh, Thanks, oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> that was Pridge in the Sim stream, by the way. I just realized. That's, that, is, that is how I yeah. fell asleep a lot in the Sim stream. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I assume this is either Lin or Sissel. I guess. Oh, I guess it can be probably Sissel. Yeah. There was always a part of me that just couldn't believe it. The yeah. image of the one who shot me. But now I see the possibility of a new explanation. But who is it? And why did they do it? Manipulate. That contraption was a birthday surprise for Camilla's mother, wasn't it? That's right. Something's been bothering me about it. I feel like I know that device from somewhere. Like maybe it killed you somewhere. <laughs> no surprise there. You lost your life. You lost your life once tonight because of that machine. Right? I knew it. Be detective Jowd. No, I'm afraid I don't see. I, I told detective Jowd about it. I told detective Jowd about it too. No doubt about it. Told him about seeing the exact same contraption tonight in a completely different place. That's very strange indeed. A junkyard on the edge of town. I've never even heard of the place. What? And what's more, I've never told a single soul about the contraption. Interesting. You have it? Hmm. That old pigeon guy. Who in the world is he? Detective Jowd, you must have heard this name before. Temps Metal Gear. <laughs> Tempsic. The meteorite that fell in the park ten years ago. You were there. Hmm. So you found out about that, didn't you? I hear that meteorite saved little Lynn's life. That's right. I couldn't do anything to help Lynn that day. But in that case, I don't get it. If that's true, doesn't it mean you didn't, you didn't steal somebody's life away? What are you talking about? Detective Jowd, you told me that ten years ago. The person who killed the perpetrator in the park was you. What? But it was the meteorite. You fool. I can summon meteor. <laughs> I wasn't lying. I stole that man's life away. No question about it. It was entirely my fault. I was just about to shoot him. I would have shot him in the next instant. If that meteorite hadn't came. Good point. If you're holding a hostage, you probably want to point the gun at the hostage, not across from you. I, any cow would probably take that shot. Mm. Hard to miss from that distance, too. At that point. Hey, when you're that close, someone whoever pulls the trigger first is going to win. Yeah. I was already a murderer. That's not how that works. That's yeah, not child, how it works. Child, at all. you are like. <laughs> 
really <laughs> prosecuting yourself on this one. It is. That's not true, Jowd. Yeah, you have a you have a freaking martyr complex, Jowd. Jesus Christ. Yeah. You were trying to save me. Lin, I'm sorry, but I don't think that's really it. What? Huh? Flip. On that day, ten years ago, a different incident happened in another place. Oh, Too many incidents. Yeah. Another place? Yes, in the police headquarters interrogation room. The worst the worst sort of incident. A suspect who was being questioned escaped. Wow, I didn't know about that. I happened to be there in the detective division, so I joined the case. Fortunately, or I guess unfortunately, I was able to track him down alone in the park. Hold it right there. fired a warning shot. I wanted to catch him. Bad. That warning shot made him panic. At the time, I was young and green. I was a young and green detective, brandishing my sense of justice like a sword. He is actually wearing Gumshoe's exact outfit. A hundred percent, yeah. I made him panic and got you involved, Lin. It was all my fault. Except it literally wasn't. Detective Chow! All I could see was my target. I couldn't even see you. I'm so sorry, Lin. I, I don't get this at all. Like, I get like him being just, like... Yeah, yeah but it just seems just wants very to take like... Yeah, for everything. Yeah, yeah. It seems very... Like, honestly, again, he's about to admit he did 9-11. <laughs> Detective Jowd can melt steel beams. Wow. So the man who grabbed me died that day. These last ten years, I've never forgotten his face. And then a few years after that, when my wife Alma died in such a mysterious way, I thought it was fate, my punishment for what I'd done. Punishment for a meteor killing someone and no one innocent getting hurt. Yeah. It was all my fault that a bad guy Literally. died and no one innocent Literally. got hurt. <laughs> punishment, yeah, so punishment for saving a child. Oh shit, life. I just noticed in the background, on his wall. Well, Oh uh, yeah, that is a legally Mino. distinct Laura. Okay, hold on, so he, hold on, hold on. He uh -huh. never said he forgot the face of the guy who killed or kidnapped uh -huh. Lynn. That is Sissel then, right? Because he's painting him right now. Uh, well, we don't know yet. I don't know. We don't know that I don't yet. know. He hasn't forgotten Sissel's face, and it would make sense why he uh -huh. would be like, I, I don't want to forget this guy. Okay, so we haven't, we haven't, that hasn't, that twist hasn't, that potential twist hasn't been said yet. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. I painted pictures in my cell. Nothing but portraits of people's faces. All the faces of the many people I'd met in my life and didn't want to forget. Sh show us the picture, God damn it! <laughs> and tonight, I finished my last portrait. The final face I want to remember. Okay, yeah. What if it was a different face now? <laughs> Zach? It was Jow's own face. Oh, I don't want to forget it. To this? The face of the man in the park that day. Wait, just one minute. That can't be. I saw that painting. I saw the face you painted tonight. Dun, dun, dun. All right, Zach, you gotta think of the silliest thing you can Photoshop on top of that picture when it first reveals. Yes. Yeah. You gotta think of like I, I don't I don't know what it I don't know what it should be. But you gotta think of just the funniest thing you can put there. Chat, give me ideas, and I'll try and do like the the YouTube edit of the uh, who's that Pokemon thing we did in uh, Easter. It's like oh, Chun Li's ass is really good. 
Oh, Charlie's ass is Fucking good. Loss. God well, damn it. Hey, so hey, I like how, I like how out of context, Zach. That still makes sense, you know. <laughs> Even uh -huh. if you were talking. Yep. yep. Painting of Chun Li's ass. Do isn't it Yang loves uh, Freddy Fat Ass Bear picture? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Freddy Fat. I think it's uh, I think it's Val's Freddy Fat Ass Bear picture. Val's yeah. Freddy Fat Ass Bear. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. It was my face. Are you telling me I was the man in the park that time? It's terrible little pins. That's right. That face of yours is the face I saw ten years ago. The face of the man whose life I stole, but didn't. The f of the man who was pronounced dead at the scene. But, hold on, Detective Jow! That can't be true! I just met Sissel for the first time tonight! I'm the one who killed him! You didn't do it! I'm the one who knocks! He <laughs> died right in front of me! Ow. Jason with the Breaking Bad reference. Yeah. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Well done. By the way, the name that I know the man in the park by that day isn't oh, Sissel. Oh, it's Thistle! Chat, you're onto it! It's your twin brother, Thistle. What? <laughs> from the minute, from the first minute I laid on eyes on you tonight, I've been wondering. Who in the world is this guy? Man. Mr. Minister. Inspector Cabanella, where are you? Just be quiet and listen. This is our demand. What? D demand Our demand hasn't changed. The execution must be tonight. Once we've confirmed it has been carried out, we'll release the hostage. What are you talking about, Inspector Cabanella? And you know it wasn't my daughter who was abducted. Does it really matter who the hostage is? A life is a life. Even if it's the daughter of a death row prisoner. Uh -huh. Once the criminal gets the punishment he deserves, the hostage will go free. Carry out the execution immediately and wait for our oh, and wait for our call. Also, low key, it's kind of interesting. I Was noticed that him relaying a message, or did Cavanaugh just come out as evil? Uh, okay, I have an idea. Okay, my theory right now, in that room, at, at that exact moment, I noticed something in that room. Okay. There was a lamp in that room, a blue lamp, and it was extended towards Cabanella. I think Mr. Fucking Influencer of the Souls, Lamp Boy, influenced <laughs> Cabanella there. He influenced L Lynn to shoot Sissel in the fucking garbage dump. Because there's a lamp there, too. why would he help him, then? As a fall guy, I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't know. There's got to be something deeper. I think that's. Okay. I think I'm in on to something. There was a lamp in Cabanella's room, and it was, like, leaned over. Uh -huh. It didn't make any fucking sense. So that, wasn't it, like... I don't, it I don't know what it was like yeah, that yeah, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> what is it? Oh, well, no, that's not... It's too, that's too... That's too... Uh, no, 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 no. That's too boy -chi. What is it, Mr. Minister? You look paler than ever. What in the world? What's going on, Inspector Cabanella? Oh. The rock of the gods that fell from the sky ten years ago twisted the fates of many people and started a chain of tragic events. And even now, the chain continues to grow even longer. Inspector Cavanaugh's call proved that to us. And the greatest mystery of all has risen to the surface. I'm sorry, this carbonated drink is making me burpy. Yeah, I feel you, dog. Also drinking sparkling water. Who is this me I've been chasing all night? Who am I? 
two, four, six, I'm oh, even, one. I'm even further from knowing that when I start. The problem is. Uh huh. The problem is, we are. We said we would get like two and a half chapters done today. Well, was we're that, gonna was see. That, was that was that the goal? Uh, yeah, because that was an hour plus half chapter. Yeah. Uh, so yes. That was a we're long. Gonna we're gonna hopefully just the exposition. Yeah, yeah. Just we're gonna like, hopefully at least get one more done and see we, what we can. Hopefully, do. try to get another chapter done. Yeah. Yeah. But the yeah. problem is, if we even if the, the other one seems like it would be so long with some twists and stuff, you know. There are officially four chapters left: 15, 16, Jesus. 17, and eighteen. Yeah. Ten years ago, a man named Sissel took a little girl named Lynn hostage. And then was killed by a me by a second meteorite on the grass knoll. Cool. Is that a defense? Uh, meteorite killed me, and I forgot to turn my homework too. <laughs> the night, a man named Sissel met a detective named Lynn at a junkyard on the edge of town, and then was killed by a bullet with butterfly wings. <laughs> <laughs> Does, despite all my despite rage, all my rage, I'm still just a rat in the I'm cage. Still just wow! A rat in the cage. Fucking wow! <laughs> despite all my oh, rage, my... I'm still just a rat in the cage. God damn it! <laughs> God, I don't like that song at all. I hate that song. <laughs> <laughs> but the scene I find waiting for me on the other end of the phone. Looks like the final nail in the coffin of my lost memory. Oh, ah! what the fuck? Plot twist! What the fuck? Wait, I liked voicing that guy. I see. Myself? Well, Jason, if only we had powers to save people from dying in this nah, video I've game. I've never heard of that before. <laughs> There you are. This? Finally. <laughs> Two things. Yeah, one, this guy's Sith? name is Commander Sith. What the Commander little fuck? Sith? Also, I love that I can tell so much of the chat does not know this game because they're also freaking out at this plot twist right now. But also, I'm 90% sure now that the voice I was doing for the tiny blue man is the same as the... It absolutely is. The inspector. You did, no, you did it. No, you did it. <laughs> no, the I, minister. The minister. The minister, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But it's also the same as the guy on the boat. The one uh, captain. Oh, yeah. Captain, no, but that's captain. a different yeah, yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. The Subidar Major? Yeah. 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 There you are, Commander Sith. Finally. I'm going to change his voice now because I can't do the same voice. <laughs> <sighs> Cecil, where have you been, my good man? We've been looking everywhere for you. Oh, is, this all, is this your version of Skeletor? It's not Skeletor. It's close, <laughs> it's, but it's not. It's like, it's like we have Skeletor at home. <laughs> <laughs> Skeletor at home? Fuck, that's yeah, really Skeletor good. Skeletor voice him. We have Skeletor at home. Uh, Skeletor but he's at not, home. But he's not Skeletor. Yeah, he man. Yeah. <laughs> I'd never give Chris the satisfaction. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I have a little unfinished business to take care of. Didn't think it would take this long. What about your people? They sure went out of their way to mess me up. I say, I believe we fulfilled every one of your conditions in our little deal. What right do you to have what right do you to have to complain about anything outside of our bargain? We can talk about that when we get together. This will be our last communication by telephone. We arrive in one hour. I look forward to seeing you, Sissel. And the lamp the lamp has moved the other direction. This, yeah, I noticed. You gotta Dawn's notice things. Approaching. The darkness surrounding my own mystery is deep. But I know it's always darkest, but just before the dawn. <clears throat> hmm, yes. We're nearing the final stages of our little deal, my good man. Uh, 
Yes, Jason sir. Man. All preparations are complete, sir. <laughs> and we just had a report, sir. Lights have been spotted, sir. Have they now? By all means, let me have a look. I forgot that animation. It's so good. Hmm, yes. We are very close. We will now disconnect from... Uh, oh, God, okay. We will now disconnect from the communication cable and have no service until we arrive, sir. Very well. Let me order a pizza first. Pizza acquired, sir. This is not pizza. <laughs> Don't think they're going to be ordering a pizza because I think they're on a submarine. I yeah, I love the transition from that being a, be like, the clear cut from it going like a, a static Jesus, game, the game screen. game cannot handle this, by the to way. To being a, a, an, a full video there. A fucking FMV file. Damn. They were on a submarine this whole time. Mm hmm In a town to live the man. Nice try, Inspector Cabanella. But you could never stop me. Evil Sissel. Oh, shit. Bissel. See ya, <laughs> sucker. And the lamp, dude. The lamp. So. That submarine guy and his people have a deal going with me, do they? If that's the case, they probably aren't the ones who killed me, right? That's anyway. The worst. There's definitely something behind the inspector's death. I think I'd better talk to him. Just kidding. It's <laughs> just lamp. Lamp. What do you know? I know you're the villain. Oh yeah, that's where the creepy detective found Lin's notebook. Oh yeah, I forgot about that character. I what a what a fun guy. <laughs> oh, Pridge is getting crazy with it. What an oddly hard hat. I'd never be able to wear anything like that because of my stupid anime hair. <laughs> Come to think of it, I don't remember seeing it here earlier. Oh. It made a loud clunk on the floor. It must be pretty solid. Why I'm ghost tricking all these. Oh, you uh -huh. actually can't go into the other room. Damn. I'm trying to do everything, but we're supposed to what we're supposed to do. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's get out of here. Scoot attack to inspect Cabanella. <laughs> oh dude, I got a knit hat to jiggle. Jiggle. Oh, my we're hats. just knocking hats oh everywhere, my baby! My hat don't jiggle jiggle, it folds. This is a pretty soft hat. I bet even I could wear a hat like this. Not with that hair sizzle, you yeah. literally cannot wear okay. any hat. Come to think of it, I don't remember seeing it here earlier. Hey, I wonder. Does that old pigeon guy think of his pigeon as- what? Okay, this is dialogue. <laughs> Does that old pigeon guy think of his pigeon as a hat? That is so relevant. Sissel, thank you. Sissel, do you remember what science is yet? These photos look pretty old. Pictures of little fragments of rock. That old pigeon guy has some pretty strange taste in wall decor. It's a meteor. Wow. I was gonna say, are you sure it's rock or maybe, um... Meteor? meteor? It's... I still don't know. I have no idea what this <laughs> instrument is used for. As a matter of fact, this whole desk is filled with things I've never seen. I know I've lost my memory, but still. That old pigeon man seems like a pretty strange- Dude, he's guy. really in on this pigeon, dude. He's going in Public enemy I'll number go... one, pigeon man. Pigeon man. Alright, I'll go actually talk to the Well, pigeons are I... public enemy number one. Fucking rats in the sky. They're, they're oh, Jason, I'm dude. so glad we're we're, we're together on team fuck pigeons. Man. They're fucking disgusting. Ugh. What a blipsy. 
Hey, do you think you could wake up for me? Ellipsis number two. Ah, oh boy. Still unconscious, eh? I guess he hasn't been dead for very long, then. I'll go ahead. I'll, I'll just go ahead and go back to four minutes before his death. I'm a little nervous about what I might see there, though. But if that's where I'm going to find my answers, I can't run away from it. Uh, if I could rewind time. It'd be an interesting death to stop somehow. Once the criminal gets the punishment he deserves, the hostage will go free. Carry out that execution immediately and wait for our call. That's a good boy. Gee, a hostage sure is a handy thing. It gives me complete control over the top police inspector in the country. Damn. What? <laughs> Jesus. Dude's evil. What's the matter? All those broken bones smart a bit? Oh, shit. All those broken bones smart, smart a, bit? a bit? Like, he broke his bones and he's saying Does it it's smarts. Yeah. Yeah, I... Like, some people say smarts is, like, hurts. Like, how yeah, that's smarts. It's... Oh! Really? I've never heard yeah. smart use as a synonym for hurt. Yeah. It's like a... It hurts, like, yeah. They sometimes use it in, like, old cartoons. Yeah. yeah, learn something new every day, folks. Yeah. What's it like to feel pain? Does it make you feel... alive? Are you doing this? Now, is that any kind of question for a top inspector to ask? Isn't it obvious? Revenge, of course. <laughs> Revenge on all the people who stole my life away ten years ago. Nope, it's, it's just Jowd. Just, it's just Jowd. Don't be ridiculous. It was a meteorite that stole your life. Or have you forgotten that? Wrong! That's metal as shit, by the way. I was murdered by all of you. That's so cool that his hand's just fucking cooking right now. He yeah. don't give a shit. Detective Jowd, who chased me down and forced me into a corner, even though I was innocent. Lynn, that girl who was right there when I was running. Lynn, she was just an innocent little girl playing in the park. If that brat hadn't been there, I never would have thought of taking a hostage. That doesn't... That's... <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you, Cabanella. <laughs> That's the most self-centered garbage I've ever heard. And finally, you, Inspector Cabanella. Me? If you hadn't done what you did, I never would have pointed a gun at that kid. But you were so proud of your spotless record. And my case was the one blot on it, wasn't it? Only two people knew the real truth. Me and Detective Jowd. I bet tonight's execution will be quite a relief to you, won't it? One of the people who know about that stain on your record would disappear for good. That's why you didn't help him escape from prison. That's the kind of guy you are. I don't know if Evil Sissel gets any fucking legs to stand on in this argument. <laughs> I got nothing to say to you. You never listen anyway. That's fucking red. Yes. Oh my god. Crumpled like a ball of trash. Oh, oh my no. God. <laughs> e gods. Now, then, Inspector. 
having to make a big red stain on your spotless white coat. That's a great line. Holy shit. Jason was right. The lamp is evil. <laughs> this was another condition of my deal. To wipe out everybody who knew about Temsic. Revenge? That's what I'm up to? None of this makes any sense. Hey, man. Man, tell me what's going on. <laughs> Inspector Cabanella. He's awake. My head is spinning, baby. Am I to understand? That Cabanella character who just got shot is me? Uh, that's right. And you're supposed to be the scoundrel there who just shot me. I... I guess so. But you couldn't be, could you? Huh? After all, the guy in the red suit just walked out the door, right? So, who are you? I guess I just have to face it. I'm not that Sissel guy. Yeah, no shit, not Sissel. Uh, I'm somebody who's searching for himself. That's why I'm here to save you. At the very least... You have information about that guy in red. Information I need. So you came on a rescue mission now, did you? Nothing like the sound of that, baby. Because there's a very important life there, uh, here somewhere. A life valuable to this nation. Okay, so do your thing, baby. Oh, he accepted that really quickly, unlike some people. I mean, so thank he, God. Thank God. <laughs> we, didn't, we didn't need all that uh, yeah. exposition going again. Okay, so here's... Uh, I'm a ghost, and I can trick. Look at him. There's that something emanating from his body. Is it really the sign of having special powers of the dead? Oh yeah, Colonel Wizard is pointing. It's really funny that Jason actually doesn't main a Fire Emblem character hey. in Smash. It's actually look. a really good point. Hey, look, I I have look. I I main Captain Falcon. He uses fire moves. It's close enough. Mm. Interesting. <laughs> there's there is there is a lack of a core for Evil Sissel, but there is something weird emanating from them. Yeah. All right. So I guess we're gonna try and. Okay, let's be honest. Well, oh, well, well, shit. Well, took shit. too long, now your candy's gone. That's what happened. Took too long, now your candy's gone. Oh, okay. What's going on? I've never seen the ghost world like this. So, you're here, are you? Oh, shit. This, this is gonna get... This is gonna get super confusing. You sense my <laughs> presence? Yeah, is this gonna be me talking to myself? Yeah, this is gonna be hilarious. A little bit, yeah, a little bit, yeah. He's, he I looks right at the you. camera! <laughs> you think you can stop me, do you? Oh my god, he's talking to us! I don't know why you're wearing my face, but you might as well give up now. I control everything! Damn it! Everything, including the life of this police inspector in white. W wait! Don't shoot! Damn. Headshot. Sissel, <laughs> you have to jump in- you have to jump into the bullet as it's out of the gun and trick it into going 180 and hitting the other guy. This 
other me. What, Zach? Zach, what's your reaction? Nothing. Nothing. You'll see. <laughs> Zach, did I finally figure out the twist? No, I mean, not quite, but... <laughs> Zach, do I have to go stick a bullet? <laughs> <laughs> What is the deal with everybody that I stream with just guessing the most, like, specific plot points in the games that we play? Like, right before they happen. That's why this has a total 100% shot. Uh-huh. No, I know it is, which is so funny that you got it. <laughs> this me knows the powers of the dead well. Who wouldn't notice what you just did? You were pre Practically shouting, look at me, baby! <laughs> Looks like it might be hard to save you under these circumstances. I guess I can't use my powers right in front of him like that. Yeah, now it's a stealth mission, too. <laughs> guess I'd better rewind the clock again and see if I can pick up any other clues. Save state, right here. Alright, now I can actually try and talk to these. That's a good boy. Yeah, Gee, I think we heard a this, hostage right? hostage sure is a handy thing. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, it's nothing. Some thoughts, though. Manipulator 2. I have ghost tricks. <laughs> Powers of the dead. Yeah, but... I can't control living creatures. Any hoot, I think you'd be very careful. That guy in red is a manipulator. Naturally, he knows about powers like yours. If he realizes you're here, things might get a little dicky. Ew. You're right. I better be careful. <laughs> Jesus. <Yes. laughs> oh, Alright. So I cannot go. You can't trick. trick things in front of them, yeah. Uh. Top of this bookshelf is lined with books. This one on top is balanced so precariously, it's a wonder it doesn't fall off. How did the old pigeon guy even reach up here? And I wonder it's, if he makes his pigeon fetch it for him. It's really still... Like, is this the time to be thinking about the fucking pigeon guy? Ugh. Yeah, no. Yeah, we already got this dialogue. I already got this dialogue. Oh my god, please don't make it stuff be good. Oh, uh, okay, I'll... Oh, did I need to be in that? Could be. You're gonna want to save... Or load the save state, yeah. You you want to be in the... I'm gonna skip this, and then save state after it. Now I'm gonna actually save state this. All right, let's rest in the tea kettle, because then I can get potentially below slash behind him. Does he is he gonna hit it anywhere without me hit clicking that? Yeah. God, it's really cool. Oh, this. Yeah, it's yeah it got trash. Did it blow up before? Do we know that it blew up? No, we, we did. We did not know this. This place was not trash when we last left here. Okay. I what? don't remember this plot point. Mention the P pigeon man again. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, now it's kind of relevant. A little. What in the world happened here? I think I'm starting to remember. Something bad happened here. Oh, thank you, Cabanella. And now, 
There's another death lying here. Oh, what? Shit. Another death? Didn't I tell you from the start? Didn't I say there was a very important life? Valuable to the nation he... I thought you were talking about you. Hmm. I'm just a crazy character in a white coat, baby. Yeah, but we love you for that, Cabanella. <laughs> Oh, oh pigeon! Dead, yeah. yeah, pigeon man's dead. Oh no! Hey, come to think of it, where is that old pigeon guy? <laughs> it's uh, relevant this time, though. <laughs> I still hate him for it. <laughs> I was not expecting it to do that. Pidgey. <laughs> Pregiota. I want to possess a pigeon. Give Damn. me the pigeon. Damn. Dead. Double ghost trick. God damn. Um, excuse me. Ghost trip perception. Who was the pigeon guy's voice? I think it was me. I think I was just doing an old man voice. <laughs> Are you awake? <clears throat> Fuck. Of course. I never sleep during work hours. Professor, do you even recognize me? No. <laughs> There's only, you. there's only one crazy character in a white coat that I know of. Myself. He hasn't lost his memory? I'm not the type who likes losing things. But never mind that. Cabanella, this is quite a surprising guest you've brought with you. Pretending that, pretending like he didn't just blow up the place. Are you talking about me? Oh, this is a different guy. I'm his guest, actually. Said he came to rescue us. Unlike you, my sharp friend, he still hasn't gotten his memory back. Hmm. Pitiful. Ouch. That hurts. <laughs> the good Sissel Sprite. <laughs> anyway. Now we'll be going back to four minutes before your death. Double. In order to Ghost change check. your fate, that is. But we already in the past, man. But well, we can go back even further. I've done it before. I still don't see a path to saving Inspector Cabanella. But if we go back further, maybe I'll find a lead. We ride them in the end! But if we're going double double on this one, and eventually we add Sissel's powers, the last couple fucking chapters are gonna be goddamn fucking like crazy, or Missile's powers. It's gonna be fucking nuts. Yeah. How many times do I have to tell you this, Professor? This place is dangerous! See? <laughs> Don't be daft. I can't leave now. I'm up all night to get lucky. But I am. <laughs> Damn it. I was. He's completely dead. But, just as I thought, I'm getting a reading. This is the source of his powers. If I remove it. What is it, his heart? Just like freaking Kali Ma rips my Kali heart. Kali Ma! <laughs> He's not dead. He's just not there. The true form of a manipulator isn't something you can detect. It's a spirit. Huh. Ridiculous. Don't judge my coat like that. <laughs> so you figured it all out, huh? Ah, uh, fuck.
You're a clever man, Inspector Cavanella. <laughs> so it's really true. You. Yo. I wasted a lot of time tonight because of you, Inspector. But it's all just like you said. I died ten years ago. This body is just a vessel. A shell. And you're a ghost in it? Ah, uh, Ghost in the Shell. <laughs> Featuring, uh, Scott Johansson. <laughs> I control everything. This shell. People. Just like I control the Justice Minister and Lynn. The media? <laughs> Good one, paper wing. So it's true. You were manipulating my baby that time. You made her shoot your shell. But why? Why would you do a thing like that? To create conclusive evidence. You know, on that security tape. To make sure Obama doesn't win re-election. <laughs> I need to have tutorials put back in the video games. And then, in 12 years, I'll give Hunter Biden's laptop to some <laughs> repair guy. <laughs> oh my god. I released Hillary's emails. <laughs> it was all me, motherfuckers. <laughs> but what about the emails? <laughs> I've decided every U.S. election the past 30 years. Also, I'm, I'm the deep state. <laughs> God fucking damn it. That's really good. That's such a good bit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, also, for shits and giggles, I, I texted all of Alex Jones' phone conversations to his opposing, just to fuck with him. He's kind of a, even for me, he's a douche. He was getting too close to discovering my deep state plans. <laughs> also, he's just a douchebag. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I, pla I planted the nuclear documents in Mar-a-Lago. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> oh. oh, fuck. <sighs> now she's a murderer, too. She'll suffer just like Chow did. But Chow didn't murder you. Then I'll blow up space to get revenge on it for murdering me. <laughs> Fuck you, space. <laughs> oh, fulfill uh, your 300 bits. <laughs> saying those bits are so good, they deserve some bits. Thank you very much. <laughs> now then, Professor. I'm afraid it's time for you to die. I don't have any grudge against you. I'm even grateful. To I you. hate pigeons, though. Oh, yeah? So <laughs> why don't you let me live then? <laughs> I'll be leaving this country forever tonight. Before I do, I need to erase all evidence that these powers of mine exist. Along with the contraption in this room. Move! Doctor, move! What are you doing? This time, this thing will work the way it was meant to. And it'll all be over. Cupid won't turn this time. He'll shoot his little arrow this way. Why is there dynamite in this room? Uh. I... Professor, look out for that randomly placed dynamite! <laughs> Oh. Yeah, you talk about Chekhov's dynamite. <laughs> even though this wasn't even established, that's not even Chekhov's dynamite. <laughs> dynamite, eh? When the devil did he put that there? 
He planned it all out tonight. Having my baby shoot him. Having his corpse disappear. His corpse disappeared? Oh, oh yeah, fuck. the blue doctor. Yeah. That medical examiner, remember him? He was a complete and utter imposter. I mean, I could have told you that. He was just running a stethoscope over the body in different positions for like 10 minutes. He said he was going to take the corpse back to the lab again. Back to the lab again. Oh, <laughs> so... oh. <laughs> oh, no. But he already made a deal with the manipulator to meet me, or meet him and give him the body back. But I wasn't going to let that happen, baby. You saw through their plan, eh? I noticed right away that the medical examiner didn't know the first thing about examining a body. Okay. Someone did. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you just just yeah, let's go over a dead body. I'm doing doctor shit. <laughs> I'm no doctor. one noticed. I have no idea what I'm doing. I knew he was a fake, so I tracked him down and him off. Bought him off? Bought him off. I had him smuggle the corpse to this room. I thought we could find the source of his powers. Of course, never in my wildest dreams did I think his abilities were powers of the dead. Anyway, there isn't much time. He's leaving the country before dawn. And I'm gonna follow him, of course, after I save you two. But something's been nagging at the back of my mind. I remember what Ray said Ray, to me a character. He said that spirits cease to exist when the day breaks. But if that's true, how could a spirit from 10 years ago still be here? Well, he is insanely powerful. <laughs> No time for thinking about it now, baby. Action is the name of the game. Work your magic and take us back even further into the past. Uh, thank you All for right, follow. we got two for water here, boys. Imaginary shadow and traffic in a box for ten bits. And Pigeon Man watching the contraption. Well, guess I'll die. <laughs> People really are fascinated by these contraptions that they have no desire to survive them. No. Also, I, I didn't shout it up before, but Soapy cheered five bits during the Sissel bit, bad Sissel bit, saying, I was responsible for the OG Mario Party 2 stream not working. <laughs> Which is so that good. Is, that is actually the worst of all the crimes we listed. It's so good. They're top. <sighs> I'm, glad, right. I'm glad round two worked. All right, man, jump in there and stop that explosion, would you? Easy enough for you to say. Foolish of you to say, too. If you stop the explosion, he'll just do me in some other way. Fair enough, then jump in there and take care of that man in red, would you? I repeat, easy enough for you to say. And most likely impossible to boot. That huge explosion didn't even make him bat an eye. Well, what do you propose then? Proof? Pray tell. <laughs> Your best bet is to save me during the explosion without him noticing. Oh, spicy. <laughs> Easy enough for you to say. Sheesh. What's with all these people? Anywho, jump in there and do something. <laughs> all right. Yeah, that's good. Good, good, spicy, good, spicy oh, wow, save yeah. time. All right, I am. Okay, I am where he died. You're also a lawyer. You just just pop the door open right now. Nothing, nothing will go wrong. Yeah. It's oh. no use. Can't open it. No use! 
could the fact that the professor is standing on there uh, on it have uh, anything to do does it with open it? upwards i guess it does it opens upwards i may look small but i'm pretty heavy set you look like you are 120 pounds soaking wet no, less it's than because that. of this He's like dump truck <laughs> ass i have under this lab coat i'm thicky <laughs> He sounds so proud of that fact, too. He's got Chun Li's ass underneath that coat. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this door. Not to mention my pigeon's ass. <laughs> Such a pity. Too bad it doesn't open downward. Damn, okay. Sometimes life can be a little hard, wouldn't you agree, Professor? <laughs> yeah, that's why we're both dead. Hmm. A door that opens downward, eh? Okay. So. Oh, it's not the body, it's the measuring device, okay. What the world is this thing? This device has the meteorite data entered into it. If it detects temsic radiation, it responds. Got that, kid? Isn't it a lovely thing? Got it memorized? I guess sometimes it's important that not, not to think about things too much. Huh. <laughs> what a sorry pair. Pigeon man, fuck off. <laughs> uh, all right, so my guess I have to hang around in his handheld measuring device till he gets me close enough to something else. Yeah, that's really your only move. Repeat dialogue. No. There you go. I shan't. Oh. Okay, yeah. Okay, so I can get the balance toy eventually. I think I think stay in the wheel. Fool! What do you think you're doing? I just thought I'd try it out. I if you do, you're going to set the contraption into motion. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I just thought, huh? He just thought he'd blow me up, is what he thought. Oops. <sighs> That was my bad. I can still hear you. But there aren't a whole lot of things I can use my tricks on in this room. How do you keep forgetting I, that, Sissel? I felt the need to trick, so I had to. This is going to be his dialogue. I trick, therefore I am. Nothing's changed. Because I know he spins it to activate the thing, but then yeah, I, I feel like this one's gonna be a, just just a huge timing puzzle. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hint. As you perhaps have already noticed, time is running out, baby. Thanks. Yeah, no perhaps about it. I know. But you know, there aren't a whole lot of things I can use my ghost tricks on in here. It looks like it's all over. Unless I find another path, I'm sort of at a deadlock here. Oh. <laughs> hey, I know that voice. Oh. Help me! Where are you? Find me! Before I'm carried away! Hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, why, why did I say hmm? <laughs> What's with the... Frail sounding call for help. 
He's here somewhere. A friend of yours? Yep. A little guy that looks a little fragile, but has strength that surprised you. He's fragile, but not that fragile. Okay. Well, he's asking you to find him. Hideo Kojima, bad at writing. <laughs> yeah, I said it. And before he's carried away, no less. But I'm almost out of time. Should I look for him? Yes. What, what are you talking about? There's still nothing I can... Can you go down? Like, ch ch maybe, maybe I think missile is lower. Oh, maybe. Or, or I guess you, you should be able to move the camera, right? Or can you only do that in not? Yeah, you can do it now, but... Oh, oh it's the it. leaf! Motherfucking... I, what did I say about Lin fucking letting the leaf go? Yeah, Cecil. kind of the worst. Here I am! Oh, hey, it's... Missile! What are you doing there? Do you really have to ask? Seriously, are you really going there? Uh, no, that's okay. Never mind. Anyway, I need your powers. Will you help me out? Of course! Here, here, let me come join you. <laughs> okay, here I am, Sizzle. Now, maybe things will flow in a new direction. Even though the flow of the sewer is a little bit stinky. You're a dog, you love bad smells. <laughs> I don't know if dogs love bad smells. Well, they certainly don't mind it. They stick yeah. each other's asses all the time. That's true. <laughs> Does track. Okay, let's stop that explosion. Uh, no. We can't do that. Okay, let's take care of that man in red then. No, we can't do that either. We can't do this. Or we can't do this. We can't do that. What can we do? We let the explosion happen. Then we rescue the old pigeon guy without the man in red noticing. And your powers are the key to all of it, Missile. No, oh, I don't know about that, but I'll do my best. We're talking about a matter of seconds. We can't miss our chance. You wanna save here? Okay, okay Missile, yeah. what can you... <laughs> Yeah, what, what can you do, do Missile? You wanna, do you want a spicy save here? Or? Oh, you might want to... You got to get Sissel out of the door. Uh, yes, I do. Spice a do different it. save, probably. Save in case I need to... Okay. Luckily, I can do all this without... Time moving, Any yeah. time passing. Uh, I will say they did give you a hint at the very beginning of, like... Yeah, it's a door. A door that opens the other way. I don't know what that gives you, though. Hmm. Lamp. Oh. Dirty magazines. Save those for tomorrow, man. Those squeaky guys are making a fuss about something. Fuck, tomorrow is Tuesday, that's good. <laughs> Sissel! My animal instincts are starting to surface! You mean you want to chase them? I think you have to be alive to do that. Hmm. There must be some kind of rat feast in that trash can. Those things usually make a bigger commotion than that. A bigger commotion, eh? That had to do with anything. Oh. Okay, yeah, it's it's just gonna be all about swapping shapes, baby. Statues. Okay, so now the second rat can get in there. Huge. Rats in love. Ratatouille. 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 Five e. 
Oh my god, these rats are going Holy fucking oh wild. God. Now that's what I call some proper commotion. They're making that trash can dance. Truth be told, I feel a bit like dancing now. Woo! <laughs> it's getting harder and harder to hold my wild instincts back. What a dangerous <laughs> bunch. Oh, shit. There's no way we're gonna get this done in one second. Oh! I'm curious how that swap. Okay. Please tell me it falls on its side. Oh! Fuck. Oh! Go! 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 Oh, it's not done yet. No! Oh! Oh! oh, oh. Stop it! Do I do it now? Yes! Oh my! Oh, <laughs> baby! <laughs> that was awesome. That was awesome. Sorry, little pigeon. As for you, Inspector, uh, I have a little job for you. Can't move. I can't dance. <laughs> I think I have four or five broken bones. Uh, I don't mind. It won't oh. prevent me from manipulating you. The idea that he makes him move around. Oh, God, that's terrible. Yeah. Oh, wow. I hate the phrasing on all of this, by the way. <laughs> it might make it hurt a little bit when it I move, you, move you around. <laughs> Quite a bit, actually. Damn you. Ugh. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. I can't believe it. You lot actually pulled it off. Sorry, Inspector Cabanella. We couldn't do anything to help you. And here I am. A poor and broken heap of arms and legs. But no matter, I enjoyed the show. The magic disappearing act, that is. Nothing like it, baby. Yeah, except, unlike a normal magic trick, I'm the one that managed to vanish without a trace here. New info, husband. Yeah. Ellipses. What's the matter? You look like you'd rather be dead. Not that you aren't. I was just remembering the fact that right about now, the real me is giving the poor justice minister a real fright. Uh oh, that phone call. Yeah, he was pretty upset. <laughs> um,. Excuse me, mister. You really shouldn't be mean like that. Again. And You're a fucking this? dog. You're a dog. What the? And what's this lively little creature? A dog. Does anybody see this dog talking here? Ah, this little doggy is the warrior who keeps Camilla safe. Or he would be. He was actually still... Full of life. I think the toke I've taken. Oh, never mind, Camilla. <laughs> God's in heaven. What a terrible thing. That poor little girl taken hostage. It's a cruel twist of fate, indeed. Wait just a minute. Miss Camilla is a hostage? Yes. We're sorry, little warrior. 
M Miss Camilla, a hostage? What's a hostage? Anyway, <laughs> Inspector wow. Kamenawa. Fucking get dunked on. It's time to save your life now. But you couldn't get very far when you tried before, am I right? But this time it's different, right, Cecil? That's right. With us working together, it's a whole different situation. We'll save the inspector in white, and then we'll go rescue Camilla, okay? Okay, let's hurry up and get through this. Gee, kids, you're making me feel like an afterthought. Who are you? Inspector in white, nice to meet you. All right, have a say. All right, let's get started. Inspector Cabanella is upstairs. So our first step is to get up there. Sizzle, I'll go up first and wait for you. Ah, goodbye. Okay, lovey dove, we need your help. Carry this measuring device upstairs. It has Mr. Ghost in it, so don't drop it. Calling a yeah. pigeon lovey dove. So, there's no way. Kind of uh, sucks. Yeah. That was kind of awesome, though. That the. Yeah, pigeon it's just pretty legit pigeon. Saved our ass. Legit ass pigeon. There you are, Sizzle! Sorry for the wait, Missile. Four minutes from now, the inspector will be killed by a gun. You could, uh, just jump in there and stop him from firing, would you? There you go again with that stuff. Besides, it doesn't make any sense. If you stop him from firing, he'll just kill you some other way. Wait a minute. That sounds familiar. Yep. Same situation as mine. Your best bet this time around is to allow him to shoot and then save Cabanella without him noticing. It's even worse than last time. Anywho, jump in there and do something. Okay, I'm ready to jump in, Sizzle. Don't forget, whenever you want to use my powers, just touch the missile icon. Fucking tutorials. <laughs> we can't. Fucking we can't. We can't, uh, we can't let. We can't let evil Sizzle get away with this. If it gets away with it, we'll have tutorials for the rest of our game career. <laughs> Alright, now Missile obviously has pretty great, pretty solid movement anywhere. Uh-huh. Yeah, miss Missile can get around no problem. Can you get to that thing with Missile from Now, my Shepard? question is, is this going to be a switching the hats kind of thing? Where I need you... Oh, I can't even do that. Oh, I can't get anywhere to start. Yeah, you're fucking trash. You have to wait until the... the thing gets knocked before Sissel can even do anything. Right. Okay, so is there anything... No, because anything I would do right now, he would see. Even if it was just Missile doing it. Mm-hmm. So but I, pro I probably have to hold for now, right? Yeah. Once again, this doesn't help me at all. Um... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, I will say 
Remember how I made a joke about it being a stealth mission? Yeah. Uh, now it is It is about manipulating things while Evil Sissel isn't looking. So probably the, the lamp eventually. There, 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 are, there are points I where he it, does I not think, look. I, I think Sissel turns around at one point. You probably can maneuver the lamp to get <clears throat> swivel it. I think he does. I thought he did. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Oh, baby. Do you want to do that? Yeah. Uh, I would say make a save state here. And see what happens next. That wasn't the right move. Yeah, maybe not. That's a tough call, though. <laughs> what was that comment? I was just like, nah, I'm not fucking talking. <laughs> this is so yeah. Good. So he's down here. So you gotta get the chicken. Ah, oh, but you, you don't get to move in that time period. Yeah, I thought you would. Yeah. Hmm. But the stool but is now chair, closer yeah. to ah, me. Ah, the stool. Can you move it behind him without him seeing it? Aha! You gotta, you gotta bust ass though. The hat to get the stool like we did previously. Yeah, drop, yeah, drop, drop the hat on the stool. Jiggle, jiggle. And then you're gonna have to swap him with missile, probably. boy. I don't know what that does. I mean, blocks the bullet. I don't fucking know. Can you move the the hat back to the other side? You have to move the hat backwards with your yeah. stool. I think maybe. Uh... Yikes, I'm a little scared right now. Why didn't he die? Because he's already dead. He died 10 years ago. I knew full well he wouldn't die if I shot him. I just like, fool. <laughs> then why did you go through the trouble of shooting him at all? Time's almost up. That's enough chit chat. Now the situation has changed slightly. These last split seconds are our chance. This is true. I don't know. I don't know how. I assume switching the hat. Oh, what is, what is ah, that up there? What is that up there? It's that's the book. book. That makes sense because, yeah, those aren't the same shape anymore. The yeah. hats. Uh huh, it's yeah. changed. I mean. What's that going Now, this one's kind of bullshit. Oh, no. Oh, it's the, the same thing now. Well, would you look at that? Right on the hook. All right, Fridge. Hey, knit hats. Yeah, Cabanella. Fucking same, by the way. <laughs> so warm. And most of all, soft. Yeah, now that I'm looking at it. That hat is the same shape as the helmet you knocked down. Ah, I thought so. Yeah. Now, I, I assume you swapped them, but I just don't know how this. Oh my god. 
That fucking thing's gonna get in the way, isn't it? Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> can he, can he, can he thread the needle, folks? This is... <laughs> uh, game? Can you go around the right side? <gasps> oh, huge bridge. Nope. Wait, what? It's the same shape, though. What? Yeah, we're in they missile mode. It. Uh. Oh my. They're not in the same orientation? Fuck that. What? Dude. Oh fucking shit, man. What? Come on, video Bro. games. Fuck that ghost trick. Okay, then we fucked up. <laughs> Some resistance, why do they both have to be gay? Fuck that. Damn. Oh! oh. Bridge! That's right, he's not looking we... behind him. Well, it's, it's different now. Oh, the sister's oh, got to get out of the hat. You have to catch it in mid-air? No, 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 no. But the hat definitely is different from the metal hat. However... That hat... is the same shape as something. Well, not... Okay. This is this is kind of bullshit. Because you would have no way the of thinking phone? about this. No. What? Just, just look at the hat again, and the way it's sitting. Yeah. And the, the way it looks in the top screen? No fucking shot. Is it the same thing as like the... Oh, wow. Remember how Pridge said? No They'd have to ghost way. trick the bullet? No way. It's the same shape as a bullet. This... <laughs> so, uh, what miracle ass shit? We already have this line. He's going to shoot. It's too late. It's no use. Even with my powers, there's nothing I can do. I don't see anything to swap the bullet with. I guess you didn't make it in time. Quit gaslighting me. It goes straight. What the fuck? We explicitly did. I'm so sorry, Inspector. I guess I'll have to try again. Oh, fucking. Again. What? I'm going to get shot again. It's within range of the gun. This is. Oh, does that? To... Wait, no. It's... It is. It is facing the way that the bullet would be facing. What the fuck? Oh, I think the hat has to be falling. Oh, what? are you kidding me? We were too early. Oh, oh my fuck. No way. The shape Dude. has to be dome like. Oh, really? I want to save the inspector in white without that guy noticing. Then I have to do something with that bullet after it's fired. I can swap it with something, you know. Then I best I get a look for something with the same shape. So when you change the bullet out, he definitely noticed that he's not fucking dead regardless. Like, he I shot mean, the this, gun. This yeah. one is the weirdest, like, yeah, how the he's fuck still gonna notice. notice that? If you shoot a fucking cloth hat out of your <laughs> fucking gun, you're still gonna notice. Swing. Yeah, and then I think I think it's that it has That's, missiles. I mean, missiles that, that, that is that. still the shape of a bullet. Yeah, in its own like, way. Like, nice, dude. So I'm just gonna sit here. I think. think so. I think so yeah. 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 Please, come on. Oh, okay, chance no way, is coming. Our yeah. coming up. The last split second, the, the last split second, right? Leave it to me. This is. Oh, would you look at that? Uh, 
The bullet is hanging in midair between the gun and the inspector's forehead. Now's our chance! I'm here in the bullet right now! How? Let's swap this little thing with something else! What? It's our only hope. There's gotta be something here with the same shape and direction as the bullet. You should like that wasn't helmet. specified, yeah. You should need the metal helmet too, by the way, which would be funny. <laughs> I never but saw a bullet the, before. But it's not the right direction. It's such a cute little shape, doesn't it? I can check out that bullet shape on the top screen. This is literally so okay. far into the game, we not, know this. I know what it's shaped like. <laughs> Bro, 2K8. <laughs> the downfall of Tutorial. That's it. Yeah. Are you... He would just... How does this work? Dude got shot with a hat. He doesn't what? check the body. He doesn't check the body. What? Do you not realize how much blood and how much of an explosive oh blood there would be with a shot like that? God. Looks like you pulled off another sorry. magic disappearing act. <laughs> again, Zach, apparently, apparently you can do the the metal hat too, and it has a funny thing. But and now I say again, I <laughs> love knit hat, so warm and most of all. Did did I did I do all right? You did a fine job, little one. You saved another life. And I'll keep doing it, too. Over and over. What I just saw in these four minutes gave me all the answers I've been looking for. Our research these past ten Pales in comparison, right, Professor? So you two were working together. That's about the size of it, yeah? Who would believe a story about a manipulator? So we pursued it ourselves, just the two of us. And the pigeon. I'm quite a crazy character myself, after all. Okay, let's hurry back! Back to our time. We'll ha we'll have to rescue Miss Camilla. You're right, Missile. And there's a certain guy I have to follow too. <laughs> that knit hat killed me. <laughs> After completing his revenge on Inspector Cabanella, the man in red left. And now, a new story is about to unfold in a new presence. <laughs> That's the most ridiculous. Confused Grandma says, good Sissel can't read and evil Sissel doesn't know what dead bodies look like. <laughs> How are you feeling, you old crazy character? Four or five of my bones are still broken. Hey there, Prof. We're both alive, I see. Yeah, nobody, nothing nobody, like it, baby. Nobody ever says Prof out loud, right? Prof. Like it's abbreviated uh, think, in text, but. I had a coach, I think, who liked to be called Prof. That sucks. Or I don't know if he liked to be called, but that's the nickname the team gave him. Okay. But I don't know if I'm getting old or what. I've got. A few aches and pains here and there. I think I got four or five broken bones, but apparently I'm good. Used to be a little thing like an explosion. Wouldn't bother me. <laughs> yeah, right. Like, I'm going to believe that. So what? Uh, so what? The guy in red is gone, eh? Just in case, I posted special investigation units all around the building. Let's just play the boys came through for us. Oh. Oh. Damn it. You picked a bad time not to listen to me. 
old body of mine. Dude, you got caught in a dynamite explosion. Yeah. <laughs> Give yourself a break. Break me up a piece. Oh, Jason referenced Kit Kats. I don't know, y'all. Jason won't shut the fuck up about Kit Kats. He loves this you know stuff. Did you know I went to Japan and <laughs> learned all about Kit Kats? It was I great. I hate chess. <laughs> well, it looks like both their deaths were erased. Unfortunately, in the case of the Inspector in White, I can't call it a complete success. But in any case, these two have the information I need to start tracking the manipulator. I better talk to them. Do you wanna, what are we? Uh, once we talk to these two people, that's the end of the okay. chapter. Okay, I didn't, I didn't know yeah. if it would like. Mr. Superintendent, do you mind if I talk to you for a minute? I haven't always been a junkyard superintendent, you know. Back in my day, I used to be part of the police. The police, huh? A cab. Not as a detective, but as a medical examiner. I investigated Fair victims' enough. cause of death. Now, when someone comments on it in the YouTube video, it's not me this time. <laughs> <laughs> Ten years ago, I was asked to autopsy a strange corpse. Hit by a meteorite fragment and died instantly. That's what the police report said. That is 100% an Ace Attorney autopsy report. Like, fucking... Yeah, it is. Yeah, there were no signs of life. He was definitely dead. But I never filed an autopsy report. I knew this one prosecutor was just going to update it. <laughs> That's because the corpse suddenly vanished. Leaving behind only one clue. An unusual corpse. I bet that's what I've been chasing all night. Could you tell me more? <clears throat> yeah, sure. <laughs> I have an interest in you recovering your memory and finding your true identity, too. There's only one way I can describe it, too. It was an unusual corpse for the fifth time. He was dead, all right. No question about it. But there wasn't a scratch on him. Not a scratch? But I thought he was hit by a meteorite fragment. I don't understand it any more than you do. I was completely bewildered. But when I tried to autopsy him, I was even more puzzled. I couldn't perform the autopsy. You couldn't? What do you mean? The scalpel went in, but I couldn't cut. As soon as I tried to make an incision, it would heal up in the very next instant. And that's how it went. And no scarring or blood, either. It's pretty busted superpower. Alright. And I never had the chance to solve the mystery. That's because the corpse been vanished on us. The morgue is well guarded. Nobody could have stolen that body. But there is only one way the corpse could have disappeared. What's that? If it got up and walked away. If it could teleport. <laughs> oh yeah, he also has teleportation powers. Wild. He, he can go Super Saiyan form three. <laughs> it got up and opened the door and walked out on its own. What? I mean, Sissel, why are you surprised? Like, it, you literally just saw the corpse. <laughs> he was dead, but he wasn't dead. 
We saw it with our own eyes tonight. Not even that explosion could kill him. So that's a good point, Sophie. His yeah. hair does look like that because he is Super Saiyan. Yeah, he's already Super Saiyan. He's permanently yeah. Super Saiyan. Yeah. And he didn't even feel it when, his, when he slammed his fist on that stove. The corpse left behind some data from some testing I did. I got some readings for some kind of radiation coming off that body. Radiation? I used all kinds of instruments, but I couldn't determine exactly what kind of radiation it was. Some undiscovered type from a world unknown. Oh no. Damn. Could no. it be? That's right. It was coming from that meteorite fragment. I went to that park and tested the spot where the meteorite fell. And just as I expected, I detected radiation coming from that crater. It was the exact same pattern of radiation as that of the corpse. At the time, I thought he was some kind of immortal being. He would die only to come back to life. I wanted to research it all in depth, so I quit my job as a police medical examiner. Several years later, I came to learn the connection between my research and the manipulator case. Thanks to the arrival of this crazy character here. Oh, stop now, professor. Do you want me to do you want to see me blush? It was uh, about a year ago, I'd say. This man in white came dancing into my research lab here. I heard there was an oddball here who's researching Tempsic. Is that you, baby? What the fuck? Who are you to be calling anybody an oddball? A ball. <laughs> I was investigating the manipulator case then. Are you the green oddball on <laughs> twitch.tv? Never heard of him. No, he's the green odd one. <laughs> oh. oh. And then I heard... <laughs> Then I heard there was a man who'd quit the police force to study the meteorites. When I heard that, it was like a meteorite had struck me on the head. But not the kind that makes you immortal. <laughs> At Why the is time, Phoenix right there? Yeah, it's we were just starting Phoenix, to right? get leads on this manipulator. Me and Phoenix were having a good conversation. We didn't know who he was yet but we knew he was communicating with a certain foreign country. Of blue people. <laughs> In one of those communications, we heard the manipulator say this. The source of my power is not of this world. And that's when I put two and two together, baby. The, manipula the manipulator case and Tepsic were somehow connected. Which also explains how five years ago he used his powers to manipulate a birthday surprise for a little girl made for her mother. He added that gun to the contraption, most likely by controlling Camilla. If I knew things were going to end up like this, 
I would have tried to die in that explosion, baby. That way I could have been dancing after Big Red by now. Hmm. I might be able to erase deaths, but it's true, I can't do much about injuries. But really, you shouldn't talk that way. Yes, sorry. I suppose you're right. I just hate feeling so... helpless. He was right there within my grasp. All our plans were resting on tonight, and then this... This had to happen. I guess he's thinking about his spotless record. It's not too late, Inspector. We still have a chance. Maybe I can catch him? Say, you're right. That's not a bad idea. I'll, co uh, I'll cooperate with you fully. Go ahead and fire away with any questions you like, Mr. Ghost. Please, just call me Ghost Trick. Mr. Ghost is my father. <laughs> That guy mentioned revenge. Revenge against the people who stole his life away ten years ago. <laughs> He's a fool. He's the one who made the decision to take that little girl hostage and he wound up dead. He only has himself to blame. But what about when he said this? I was murdered by all of you, yada 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 yada, and finally you, but if you hadn't done what you did, yeah, 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 yeah. Yanni Yogi in the elevator. Yanni Yogi in the elevator, DL6. Oopsies. Yes, ten years ago, on that day, the special, uh, the special investigation unit was working on a certain big case. We hauled in a young man, an important witness to our investigation. And then, I did it. I made ve two very stupid mistakes. Detective, I'm, I'll, I'll tell him ya. I don't know anything about it. So that's oh, gotta be. That's gotta be a typo, right? Yeah, yeah. Fine, fine. You're under no under obligation to talk, of course. But if you don't, the Special Investigation Unit can make the rest of your life a living hell. But... I... I've just been assigned to the Special Investigation Unit, you see. They didn't share much info on big cases with a newbie like me. I wanted to impress them. It was only supposed to be a simple matter of talking, talking, taking his statement. But I was too green, eight ball. <laughs> I pushed him too hard. I drove him into a corner, and I made him lose all hope. That was my first mistake. And then I made another mistake on top of that. Cabanella, got a minute? The chief wants to see you about your report. Got it, I'll be right there. You stay right there and be a good boy now. And that's when I did it. I left behind in I, I left it behind in the interrogation room. My gun. Man, you are really wow. bad at shit. Wow. How could you? He used my gun to escape. Yeah, that's a, like, a big oopsie. Yo, how are you not instantly fired? Yeah. If I hadn't made that mistake, I'd, I, uh, he never would have had the gun to point at Lin in the first place. 
I was manipulated to leave it, I swear. <laughs> we first found out about the manipulator's existence during a certain overseas communication. Overseas communication? For national security purposes, this country keeps tabs on the communications network. This particular communication was about making a deal with a certain foreign country. He said he wanted to buy him, him and all his powers. That's how we first heard about him, of course. We didn't know what he looked like at the time. And in order to prove these powers of his, he gave them two predictions. He foresaw two completely preposterous, impossible cases. Uh, okay. The case of a man who would sing National Secrets during a live rock concert broadcast. In the case of a man who would take the chief commissioner hostage in his own office. <laughs> Those two inmates at the special prison, eh? We kept tabs on their communications and, and launched uh, an investigation. And then finally, we pinpointed where they were going to meet tonight and staked it out. Oh. Yes, yes, give me a... Please. <laughs> that restaurant! Okay. Oh, that's oh yeah, you. yeah. No, that's you. It's you. Is it? That's you, I think. No, because Kevin was talking about where they were staking oh, okay, out. yeah. That restaurant, the Chicken Kitchen. The manipulator plans on leaving the country tonight. On a submarine that belongs to the other country in this deal. The Blue Country. The submarine? So you're gonna say they're all gonna live on a submarine? And the Blue Is Meanies? It it's piloted by the Blue Meanies? But we haven't been able to find out where it's going to surface. It's terrifying to think what would happen if his powers were to fall into their hands. Right. Highly unlikely they'd use them for peaceful purposes. Now they have that little girl as a hostage. No. We have to stop him before he leaves the country. Oh, I've been lender. Thank you for tuning in. This, this is not my line. <laughs> this spotless record of yours. Is it really that important to you? Of course, baby. In some ways, it's more important to me than my life. Than your life, eh? Than your life, eh? After your all, life, eh? it's, it's because life, of eh? my record that I'm able to get my hands on all intel as head of special investigation unit. Spotless record, not including leaving a gun behind, but okay. Yeah. <laughs> and because of my position, I get to direct all aspects to of, of the investigation into the manipulator case. Manipulator case? That's why you cared about your record so much? Of course. What else, baby? I just never could believe it, man. Jow shooting, Alma? I didn't care that he confessed. There was something more to the story, some secret. I did everything I could to climb the ladder, everything in my power. Then finally I found the answer. It took five long years though. The manipulator. He's going to prove that Jowd is innocent. Determination. Come on. <laughs> There's one thing I just don't understand. If you were so determined to help Detective Jowd, 
Why didn't you help him escape from prison? That's an easy one, baby. Escaping from prison is a crime. Wow, got us on that one. I don't, yeah. And it is a crime, that's true. I wasn't able to help him commit a crime after spending five years trying to prove him innocent. He himself asked to be executed, you know? As a man of the law, I had to make sure that the execution was stopped legally. And that's me, dancing. I brought him in before the justice minister, too. I needed to buy as much time as I possibly could, baby. So that's it, eh? Or am I so Canadian all of a sudden? <laughs> Life, eh? But there's one little unfortunate result of all this, eh? <laughs> Lynn completely misunderstood your intentions, eh? What's a little under misunderstanding? My baby will come around. Give it time. But there are more important things to do with our time tonight. That contraption in the basement here. You built that to try and help Detective Jowd. That's right. Jowd and I worked together back when I was with the Force. I used the reports of this case, to, or of his case, to try and recreate the device. But there was just one part of it that I couldn't reproduce, no matter how hard I tried. Willa told Jout it did something it shouldn't have, and made an impossible move. I added that part to the device I recreated. I put in the part that would allow Cupid to rotate, otherwise the gun wouldn't fire. So that must mean someone manipulated Camilla's contraption. As a result, we proved ourselves we proved to ourselves that the manipulator actually existed. Oh, hey. Inspector Cabanella! Hey, baby. Sorry about that phone call. I must have sounded like a real villain. I hate, I hate it to spoil your image of me. Of that cool cat, Inspectigator. Uh, Inspectigator. <laughs> Inspector. Inspector. You always looked up to. Is that really the image she had of him? Not, not a huge Inspectigator fan. I'm more of a uh, <sighs> Detectagile. <laughs> hey, Inspector Cabanella. I'm sorry. I, I just heard. You were chasing after that man all this time to try and help Detective Jowd. This manipulator is such a dangerous character. I was hoping you didn't have to be involved. So that's why you had me arrested tonight, isn't it? Like I always say, if somebody's in the way, throw them in the slammer. I'm a bad. <laughs> Yikes. Even Cecil says they can. Tonight. We're going to have ourselves a real good time? Yeah. I really thought we finally had him. But my body gave out on me at the critical moment. You're acting like you threw out your back. Yeah, you like literally you, you, were, you, you were jumped within, into an explosion and had ribs you were within, broken. Like, you were within 10 feet of a dynamite explosion. You <laughs> should be dead. Yeah. It's like a cool joke. Oh my god, everybody. <laughs> but a joke is a joke. You may as well laugh. <laughs> Get fucked, dude. Ow. The minister caught off the execution order. 
And while he was at it, he let Detective Child go free until tomorrow morning, too! That's a pretty extreme while he was at it. All right. Sorry. Are there any other characters we can throw into this small room who know about oh, ghost Lynn. tricks? Oh, I lost my. I lost my. I love you so much, Lynn. Yeah. <laughs> I still haven't figured out how much my wife weighs. <laughs> Sorry, I took so long to get here. You can leave the rest to me. There you go again. You've always been like that. You make everybody else. Run around, then you swoop in at the last second. Jowd, five years ago, you left this coat with me just before you turned yourself in. It's time to become Detective Gumshoe. I promise yeah, to give must... it back to you one day. <laughs> you must re recapture your true identity. It's time, pal. <laughs> you must become a himbo. Yeah, this fucking bird is legit. <laughs> I love that he still has the fucking prison. Still has the, yeah, the pajama, the, the jail garb. I've been waiting so long, Detective Jowd. Waiting for this day to come. Thanks for not giving up on me, Lynn. Okay, I'm off then. Good luck, my old friend. Can someone take me to the hospital? I'm currently dying. <laughs> this present you gave me is just what I needed. Thank you. Glad you like it. Cool, bro. Wait, did you just get tired from... <laughs> Sissel, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> you and I have to go find that man. I need your help. Will you do this with me? You know what? I'm actually done now. Yeah. I'm just gonna stop. I feel good. I feel good about I this I feel like one. I've done enough tonight. Folks, that's gonna do it for this stream of Ghost Trick <laughs> with an actual... <laughs> Sure, but how? We don't know where the submarine is, and the phone line doesn't work. They use communication cables to make their calls. We'll get you hooked up somehow. You'll see. Could you please wait here, though, until we do? Please? Okay. Fine. I'm counting on you. This true self you're looking for... I bet you'll find it soon. All right, I'm leaving, Ca Inspector Cabanella. Who cares about your wounds? Yeah, genuinely, this dude has like several broken ribs. You gotta get this man to the hospital. It's almost done. I'm not who I thought I was. I'm actually further from knowing. I'm actually further from knowing who I am th than who I am than ever. But now, I don't feel so alone. Half the city's population can talk to me because they've all died tonight. <laughs> so at least I have a lot of conversation partners. Mm -hmm. Each one of us, for his or her own reasons, is looking for the truth. Together, I think we can shed light on these mysteries and drive away the darkness. But it's almost dawn. Hey. hey. Hey, that was a you. monster chapter. Yeah. yeah. Both of these well, chapters were like hour and a half long plus. Yeah. And then I popped them on screen. What's 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 gonna happen? Oh. Oh. Uh, how do I? Gah! Gah! <laughs> Gah! Oh no, the lamp! I literally was like, "What the Damn, fuck the is lamp! Jason doing?" And I looked over at the stream to see oh, the lamp killing him. The ghost trick. Oh Damn my God. the lamp! That's so good. Ah! Get me to a hospital! <laughs> Quick!
Oh, oh my, my god. god. It's, it's brutal. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, man, he dead. Yeah. <laughs> that didn't go well. That's so funny. God damn. damn. I almost wish we had fucked that up. Yeah. Uh, Chrono Wizard, thank you for this art. Uh, I, the, the missile's amazing. <laughs> the fucking... Oh, uh, shit. The lid line in the bottom. Time, huh? <laughs> I call it bold and brash. More like belongs in the trash. <laughs> this fucking... I still can't hey, stop laughing hey, at Giga Chad. I know, I know, I, I know who I my, I know what my favorite is. Evil Sissel, I can read. <laughs> I know what my favorite part of the, the art is, you know. I, oh, but, yeah, the green, green the, hair girl. The, the, the chicken girl in the top right. Oh, man. Yeah. So I love his, I love Sissel attempting to work. Oh my ass. god! How do we not think about this joke? That's so brilliant, Colonel Wizard. Rock of the Gods being Rock Lee. I may have mentioned that. Oh yeah, that I was actually day. expecting you to make that joke. How? People it's were making so that like crazy in the chat, man. I oh. was hoping you were. Going shout, shout out to everyone who made that joke. I'm an idiot for not noticing <laughs> it and also not not thinking of it. Uh, and yeah, all, all the hats are so good. <laughs> Uh, we also, this is by Little Waves. This is awesome. This is very, very good. This is incredible <laughs> of us as three of our characters. Whoa. Missile, Missile and Zach's banana shirt's amazing. It's, I, I'm dying at it. It's the banana shirt and like the little tuft of chest hair that I love to show because I'm a oh, fucking yeah. punk the, ass the, bitch. The, 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 the taco it's, meat, yeah. It's not taco meat. You shut the fuck up. You shut the <laughs> fuck up, Jason. It is not taco meat. Uh, it's so good. Fucking <laughs> West, or sorry, Bridge with J Bridge with Sissel's hair. Names are hard. Uh, is incredible. The and the then of course the car. Jason shades. Ah, they're in my car right now. Okay. <laughs> uh, the Pokemon Queen with uh, uh, very cute Litwick. Litwick with Sissel on top. Is super adorable. It's adorable as hell. <laughs> Litwick. Good point. Ghost Trickwit. Pirate, trick wit. <laughs> that's good. Folks, that's going to do it for, for another Ghost Trick stream. All right, folks. Take care. And we'll see you maybe Wednesday for the Ace Attorney finale. Or Trials and Tribulations finale, I mean. But take care, y'all.